I don't know if the mics will actually no. pick up your gasps. You just have uh, to now inhale playing the mic. Hollow yeah. Knight. <laughs> I never played Hollow Knight. If you enjoy Metroidvanias, it's that where you have to jump around different mm -hmm. paths multiple times, get slightly stronger, and then do more things when you go back. I mean, platforming. I don't know. I don't know. How are you with platforming? Decent. Okay. Right, really enjoy it. Like real life platforming? No, yeah. that's great. Can you imagine if I was like just an expert parkourer or yeah. like wall, like boulderer? Well, it's like that parkour gym that we pass every so often. What about it? Oh, right. Yeah. You're not going to join awesome. parkour gym? I mean, it's I tempting. kind of do actually want to. Cool. Yeah. It is. Oh. It's just temporarily, just like clipped in place, but um, it's foreboding more curtain to come. Ooh. Hello, everyone. Why do we look different in daylight, Kung Fu Fenris? That that we actually are lit exactly the same way as we normally are. Yeah. Perhaps it's our uh, our visages are like more bright, more like we're not I just like. The, I think it's the curtain that like we're, we're not world, world weary. Black, right? Like there's there's some depth of color. Mm. Yes, Scott, you must now wear that shirt every week. Oh no, I would hate wearing this jewel tone shirt every week. Who me? Jewel tones, ugly. <laughs> ugly. Anything ugly. that isn't black <laughs> is jewel tone. Like, right. uh, I mean, I guess this is technically not black, but it's right, right. It's, it's, like, it's fine. Yeah. Good. I, I do have my blazer as well. And if I bring my body temperature down a bit, I will put it on. To, to 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 be extra swank. Wee. Are you feeling extra swank? Feel the same amount of swank that I normally feel. Mm. Other than the fact that since I replaced my razor cartridge, oh. I'm actually getting a halfway decent shave. Oh, nice. Hey. Oh, good. There's like a oh. I'm at the end of one of my like razor's lives and i'm just like, kind of like i don't want to change well because i shaved them with electric yeah so right. it's been 18 months oh it's been 18 months it's been 18 months then i just throw my razor into the ocean Oosh. no that was the whole point <laughs> turtle comes by and yeah like, it's hit on the immediately head just like, just like up. yeah Sigh. Yeah, blunt shaves suck. Mm hmm. Agreed. Yay. 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 Now that you're all awake, you're going to be like, oh, God, this is terrible. Don't worry about <laughs> oh, no. Can Watch you imagine? This stream was so much better when I, when I was <laughs> ill rested. When we're ill rested, <laughs> things get a little wild. Yeah, a little curly. I, I don't start hitting the wacky tobacco until nine o'clock my time. Yeah. I never realized these people suck. <laughs> <laughs> Crosser asks a good question. How are we all feeling about starting at this time? I feel great. I feel great. I still, this is like, I feel like I usually dip in energy around this time of the day, but I've changed my, you know, caffeine and sleep patterns and what, like, I feel good. I feel good being here, so. Yep. I had to keep reminding myself this morning. Mm -hmm. Sorry, dude. That's fair. Yeah, I fully ran out of time this morning. Like, well, we woke up and I was just like, ah, there's all this time. I'm gonna do an an arm workout today. Gonna gonna putter around and get some get some things done, and then just yeah. Liz's arm workout is me walking by and her just throwing me to the floor. Oh like God. every like, every time I walk by, she's just like, uh. you just you just push me. Yeah, I, I'm just strange course. muscle isolation too because you it doesn't pick me up and like suplex me in. Oh, like the like the ball slams. Like the ball slams. You heard it here first, folks. Eric Gwen, hello and thank you so much. I'm not saying anything. I was shushed, but I did. <laughs> I, I, I did out of nowhere realize that means we've been on RPG Clinic as a channel for three years. So that's Whoa. Kind of super cool. wow! Yeah, it would have been. I mean, around this time, <laughs> right? Yeah, specifically. <laughs> This also now shatters my secret assumption that Erwin and uh, uh, what? Ellie Spot are. Yeah, I was like, which E did I say? Uh, it wasn't, like, I didn't forget. Oh, the oh I which one did I say first? Uh, are the same person. They're not. Also, I've been shattered as well. My whole worldview, really. 
I remember when you were putting the channel together. I remember when you were balancing cameras on board games. And it's especially bananas to think that I have messaged each of them with theory crafting at various times. The idea that I was talking to the same person is just <laughs> They're delightful. consulting their murder board to be like, what have I already bizarre. told you as the other person <laughs> yet? <laughs> kidding, by the way. What this way, this I'll always be no. right. Somehow. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Oh my god. Oh, that's good. True. At least, but uh, part of my headcanon there. is that there's not enough planning that goes into this. You have separate Discord. Oh, oh yeah. I mean, I mean, I. I uh, <laughs> At least, but is it is it also safe to reveal that you are currently baking right now? <gasps> baking. No, you're baking. <laughs> And I hope it's going B -R -B. splendidly. Like, they've got very similar name colors, but they aren't the same name colors. Yeah. They're carefully curated. I mean, I am just me. <laughs> Strange. Uh, for all of you who are watching out there in VOD land, uh, or perhaps listening on the podcast, the reason why all of this conversation is happening is because this is the first stream where we have started instead at... Uh, well, we originally on the stream started at 1800, mm -hmm. we went to 1700, and now we are at 1400, which means that another three years we'll just be starting, we'll be waking and streaming. Yeah. Yeah. I'm we'll waking, but I'm streaming. Yeah. Venice or yeah. Doomed or whatever right. it is for your Saturday of choice. Drive here. Yep, yeah, immediately. In the pitch black. Yeah. <laughs> cameras are already on when I wake yeah. up. It's very Truman yeah. Show, yeah. very strange. Oh, yeah. 24 hour circle. Oh, it's just it's the twirling circle. Just us living as our characters. I was, I was voted this? down for this book. Okay. But at one point, I didn't want a 24 hour camera, but at one point, I wanted to have a camera kind of like up here somewhere mm -hmm. that was aiming down on all of us so that during pre show, it would show a blurred oh, image right. of us like moving in and, and like prepping. setting up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can do that now. I remember that. That's a thing that we can do. So let me know before you install it, and I will wear less <laughs> less cleavy. <laughs> I don't mean that we'll necessarily put it directly above you. <laughs> it's right here. <laughs> uh, Ellie Spot, huge ups to Bebe's birthday story. tomorrow. That's very, very, very wonderful. I hate the screaming for you. Love the birthday for you. I mean, we already sang, I guess. Yeah, we did. Yeah, it's going to be replayed, as you recall. Yes, it's being clipped and replayed. That would be him. It'd be you. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just, I saw a couple of streams doing it, and I was like, oh, it's nice to show that, like, yeah, some stuff's actually happening. Like, yeah. don't worry. I mean, I would be so tempted to then just start staging drama for people with that webcam. Oh, you know, yeah. I'm getting up in your face and I'm like, no, you let me play this character, Someone, man. Like, and you slap me. The, and, yeah. and then Liz sure. we falls. We choreograph a whole fight. Yeah. Fall slam. Time for the daily fall slam. <laughs> the daily. <laughs> Have you done your daily snow list, please? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I kid, I kid. I want to make it clear that I am kidding. And sh <laughs> shut up, Kung Fenris. You don't know me! <laughs> you do. I run. Oh, yeah, you, you, this is correct. Twitter will find it. <laughs> ah. I mean, we may decide to do it at some point, but oh. we haven't decided to do it yet. But we have decided oh. to change the time. So here we are. Uh, one of the things we're going to ask is that if you have any thoughts or feelings about this, please post them on the Discord. We do want to hear about it. Uh, this is in preparation, of course, for uh, whatever we end up doing after this. Uh, we're testing this as our permanent time as opposed to just a one-off. Uh, the second thing that I'll point out is that we are having some slight difficulty with one of our cables. Uh, we're not gonna like get into it, but if you see the player cam or the storyteller cam drop, uh, we just gotta fiddle with some cables. We've ordered new ones, they're on the way, but if it happens, we're aware of it, but please just like, you know, let us know. We don't have to interrupt the stream to try and fix it, but mm -hmm. if it happens, now you know why. Um, we hope it won't, because we don't want to deal with that shit. Yeah, we'll notice. I think if that's it, what, yeah, if that's it's fucked we'll, off, we'll so you don't even have to worry about scrambling. Like, I can't see you! Yeah, if the stream itself goes down, tell us. Yes. But oh, like, if the camera too. just goes gray and it says no signal, we also are going to see that at the same time, probably even three seconds before you. <gasps> Gasp! <gasps> I do like Dio. Wait, Dio, wait, wait, remind wait. me at some point. Actually, Dio, can you private message me on Discord or something? We, I have a 
thing that I wanted to ask you. It's not urgent or anything like that. Just hit me up. It was a thing. And I, I literally only just remember right now and I'm oh, horrible. Thank you. There we go. Perfect. Are you commissioning some just it will crochet it goodness? <laughs> yarn art, yarn art. Yarn art. I don't like yarn. He decided to replace you with a with a yarn with a, version of me. A whole size crochet. Oh. I just think I was really so happy with that. Mm. Can I creep no, under no, no, the no. table and voice no. myself? You're not no, either. I can't Sorry. even voice my replacement. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. It's also gonna be really disappointing when like every once in a while. Scott just turns around and just mashes his face into like the big yarn Liz. I uh, get those soft. Get one ripcord line so that you can be like, ding, 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 and it'll be like, I, I punch it in the face. Oh, uh, yeah. I pass it, get power. <laughs> <laughs> Nolan North, I approve this message. Oh, shit. Yay. I also approve this message. <laughs> he probably needs a job, right? Good lord. Uh, yeah. It's surprising how many people in the industry is like, can we just get Nolan North? And everyone's like, no. No. <laughs> do, you, do you think he's not busy? It absolutely blew my mind when I realized that he also did film and television acting mm. and that he was on Pretty Little Liars as like yes. a big role. I also, when you told me that, I was like, eh? I'm like, wait a minute. Is Gross. that Nolan North? Like that <laughs> blew my mind. It's so weird. I think Dio Why just messaged here? me on Discord. Dio did just message me on Discord. You know what? Just isn't it great when when you have this like live interaction where you're like, could you do a thing and then a thing happens? And you're like, I just I just had a thing happen to me in real fucking time. Yeah. Uh speaking of real time, did you grow? No, we did not grow. Uh, we, are, we are not growing. We'll just show your experience. <laughs> you are close to growth. Uh the growths are budding. Imminent. They're about to pop out, but <laughs> there is no look, look, I like puberty as much as anybody, okay? I just, oh, jeez. Popping. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, look, sometimes it's really important that you make sure that when these sorts of growths happen, mm. pay attention to them because that's what keeps you safe. It's yeah, true. it sure is. Who's sometimes is all you need are fucking cards. Whose turn is it? Yours, Ooh, okay, actually. Okay, great. All right. Fantastic. No, that's fine. Uh, all right, folks. So... Uh, you have some tools available for you if you have something that needs attention, uh, safety-wise. But for us, we have these cards. Uh, <laughs> damn you, come from <laughs> uh, So if you're showing the green card, the play card, that's a signal to everyone at the table that despite your outward appearance, you, the player, feel safe to continue. Uh, if you're showing the yellow card, however, uh, folks need to pay attention for a second as you inform the table of something uh, relating to your safety, something that they just need to be aware of before gameplay can continue. Uh, the stop card, the red card, however, means that gameplay will be completely interrupted. We will go to a BRB screen. It is an opportunity for everyone to drop character, drop what's happening in game, discuss, and come to a re resolution whereby gameplay will only continue once everyone at the table feels safe to continue. If you don't have cards, you do have options. You can uh, throw a message uh, in chat. We may not see it, our moderators might. Um, you can whisper us. We will see it highlighted for us. Uh, you can also whisper one of our moderators who would be happy to keep it anonymous for you if you so choose. Um, but we have three moderators in chat right now. Woo! Best Woo! Mods. Um, so yeah, you have a selection. They're indicated with a little green sword next to their names. Um, and, uh, of course, if you need to prioritize your safety, we encourage you to do so. Uh, you can always close stream or close chat or both. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't want to see you go away, but we do want to see you safe. Mm -hmm. so th oh, thank, <laughs> thank you. you. And bless Robitussin? <laughs> Robitussin, there we go. If anyone from Robitussin is watching. <laughs> your ad campaign clearly worked. It clearly worked, <laughs> and we will take sponsorship. God damn it. I will... I just off, want to like high five that marketing every... person. Oh, it's... Yeah, it's a good shout. What a good call. Mm -hmm. What's this? Uh, Dad, when someone sneezes, you say bless you, right? Well, what do you say when somebody coughs? Robitussin. Ow. Yeah. And it, like it but, actively but... worked on me. I still say Robitussin. You too. When yeah. Coughs. Like, totally worked on me. Yeah. When I my instinct is to say bless you when someone coughs, I think yeah, of that. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. It's not shut up. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Stop your coffin. Have you tried breathing? No breathe. Like, <laughs> God. Good lord. Oh, boy. 
My favorite would be like, go see a doctor, and then it pans to a doctor, and I was like, I don't want to deal with this shit. Oh no. <laughs> pans too. I can't help. <laughs> Fucking cold. Have you tried rest? <laughs> How about you drink fluids? I'm coughing here. Coughing here. I'm coughing here. <laughs> <I'm coughing in. laughs> uh, tell you what, there's a lot of people here. It's really good to see all of you, but it's very clear that you may not have been here last session, so you might need a little recap on what I, what occurred. We can help with that. Talk about a baby boom! Don, reeling from the news that she may be connected to Takata, decides to put her seeker responsibilities above family feuds. For now. Speaking of family feuds, Yong Su challenges Sela to a duel. Cutting words become cutting jabs, and the corrupt Kiyoshi warrior is put out of action. Bao has Jai lock up Sela while Kai Ming takes her sister's place on the airship. The general agrees to tentatively trust his cousin. For now. Yong Su takes a bow class in keeping cool before meeting with Takata. She boasts that she'll be more powerful than a councilwoman in mere days. Yong Su manages to not push her off the back of the airship. For now. Can our trio save the spirit world, the Sawan, and themselves? Will Jai get the proof he needs? And who has the hots? For now. I was very proud of that. Oh, <laughs> oh man. I feel like you wrote that and then worked backwards. <laughs> yeah. no, actually, uh, well, I was trying to think of a play on words, but I, I think I, yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Cut, 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 yes, cut. it was intentional. <laughs> Mucho aplaudito. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Ellie Spot, if you have smooth ganache in your ears, I would <laughs> suggest seeing a doctor. <laughs> that feels like something you can't deal with on your own. But, but what if what if I just use it as an excuse and like, oh no, I have to go to Sweden to see a very specific doctor. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> my cover it health lines. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, I, I just need a yeah. doctor over here. Yeah, it's literally. Oh, oh no, get me to you know. Tragically, I can't see doctors. They are invisible to me until I have coughed at least twice. Ah uh, yes, <laughs> tragically. It is. Wow. It is a burden that I bear. <laughs> Oh, thank goodness I'm alone in this elevator. I'm right here, man. What the hell? <sighs> Look. Yeah. <laughs> Look. Are there any questions before we begin? We're already late starting. We knew yeah, this no, was going to happen. Yeah, no, of course, 100%. Yeah, we love everybody. Yeah, yeah. Um, no. Okay, people are coughing in Ellie Spot's ears. <laughs> I think there's smooth baby. ganache in Ellie Spot's ears. There's, there's, there's maybe a little. Oh, yeah, that would do it. There's smooth ganache and a lot of people coughing in Ellie Spot's ears. It's just a. It's just going to keep going. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Chat's amazing. Several That's hours. Cool on podcast. Uh, we're sorry that you missed out on chat because they're pretty clever. Wait, I'm not a doctor. Oh, shit. Oh, man, who have I been paying all these years? Not me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not covered by the Ram Q. Which, right, never mind. We're not going to get into that. Here. Ram Q. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Anyway. God damn it. <laughs> I like how uh, Pook asked the question and it queues up. Yeah, well, he, he used the system. That's the system. We have question asking system set up mostly for clinic hours which but just in case yeah all right uh we all know that the real reason why Aragorn is in chat right now it's because you're currently on <laughs> summoned her <laughs> legit <laughs> You ever hear about the calm before a storm? Mm. It's kind of true, and it's also kind of absolute bullshit. Like the the issue with the the idea of like it's calm before the storm. It's also s s things like saying it's always darkest before the dawn. No, it's not. <laughs> like it very it very simply is not. It it is darkest in the time midway between evening and dawn. <laughs> That's when the sun's not around. Furthest from the yeah. yeah. Uh, in, in much the same way, uh, 
there often isn't calms before storms, but storms are coming. And as long as the storm is coming, it's important to recognize that sometimes you must artificially create calm. Because if you walk into a situation with your blood pressure spiking and your adrenaline coating the inside of your mouth and the your, your breathing rate is rapid and shallow, you're not necessarily priming yourself for peak efficiency. Speaking of peak efficiency, if we have a look at how all of you are doing, uh, Young Su's still kind of <laughs> fucked up. Hey, oh man. Yeah, you're uh, right. Both in terms of conditions and in terms of fatigue. If we have a look at your balances, uh, none of you are doing all that much better. Shit, right. So, you are in a state but you are also in a state room on this airship uh the captain has announced over a loudspeaker that you are going to be returning to republic city and you will be arriving there within a day so while you are on the way to republic city from if you'll recall fire fountain city mm -hmm. You have a day left before you're going to touch down, and then you'll have other things to deal with. So Bao would like to try to get everyone together in one place to chat. Everyone being Don, Young, Su, Kaiming, and possibly now. We don't know if now Oda got on the airship. Wasn't she with us? I don't remember, to be completely honest with you. I, I'm, you know what? I'm going to check my I notes before I start was. making we, weird we actions. Okay, now we're yeah. on the airship. Right. Excellent. Then, yeah, perfect. Um, I know these rooms are uh, for two people each, so I'm sure we've all crammed into somebody's room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like basically two people sitting on each bed, one person standing is sort of what I picture. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That. Uh, oh, they're bunk beds. Oh. Nice. Don has been meditating almost non-stop on the deck of the ship, but takes a break from that to, to meet with the others. Every once in a while, just crew members trip, like, whoa, shit, oh, God, oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm communing. You're so at peace, I didn't even see you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So, I know we can't plan for every eventuality, but I said a lot of things while we were in my hometown, and I want you to know what was real and what was a facade. We do need, as far as I understand, Jai intends to bring his army into the spirit world and he feels like he has to no matter what. But what they do once they're in there, hopefully we can change. Right. He'll be there to guard me and the other forward mm. don't like the word settlers that's but what i want you to be that's right so if something is to happen a conflict i'll be there to try to either defuse it or lead people to lay down arms we don't want any bloodshed no this can't erupt into fighting is there i know spirits are pretty spirited but would they listen if you encourage them to give some space for a bit of time? I'd like to go and talk to them, but I can only access them through the portal. Okay. So I need to talk to my order. I need to see what they were thinking by agreeing to help Takata. Maybe right. they know something I don't. Or we need to know what they agreed to. Yeah. But I would love to hear directly from the spirits to know how I can best support them. Maybe, maybe they have a plan. <laughs> maybe they know a lot more than I do. Ultimately, in order to stop this, we need to... What? Like, we can't just snap our fingers and make it stop. We need to stop Dakota. Correct. Convince the army to stop, so I need to get proof for sure. Something. Dakota told me that it's only a matter of days because before she becomes even more powerful. That tells me 
more powerful than a council one. Exactly. Like, I don't. You have a deal with some toe, maybe that if she brings a whole bunch of victims in for him to eat. Um, I don't know. Sorry, oh. it's spirits aren't evil, but uh, he sounds pretty scary. Ko has his own code that he follows. Ah, uh, yes. And it the changes code. all the time. The code. <laughs> I need to speak to him. I can do that when we're in the spirit world. He wants to talk to me. I can try to find him. He wants to find you. Maybe. Okay. But what we need is incontrovertible proof <laughs> that what Takata is doing is self-serving and not for the good of others. As soon as Sawans, as soon as the Order realize that they're being played, everyone turns on her, she folds. And they take back their support. But Great. all that time, we need to pretend to play the game as much as possible. If we go up on that deck right now and scream into Kata's face, we'll just get locked up. Even if we don't fly to people's faces, I think we need to keep our heads low until we're ready to make our stand. Timing shifts forward on the bed. But there's something more to it than that. I mean, look, Young Su's a good guy, but it would just be easy to throw him into prison instead of forcing him to be the first colonist of the spirit world. That just seems like an overly elaborate thing to do. He represents something. He stands for something. He was displaced by Dakota, and... Everyone we've ever spoken to who has been on her side, they've talked about her view of progress, her view of the future, her view of a changing world, and I still don't know what that is. I tried to get her to tell me, and she wouldn't. I wonder whether I represent something to her that she's trying to eliminate, change, Erase. If you go quietly into a new home in the spirit world, that means that she can take over any cities she wants because she can just tell the residents that there's a plan for them. No matter how bad of a deal it is. I mean, people were displaced when the spirit portal opened. So she can claim that these people have a place to go. She doesn't have their best interests at heart, but we all know that. Um, I've been, I've been trying to avoid talking to her, uh, this whole trip because when we were, um, and when we were in her home, I found a nursery and there was a photo in there of Takata and who I presume was this fiance that we've heard tell of and they had a baby and the, the, the man in the photo looked a lot like me. Young Su crosses his arms and like kind of kicks the ground a little like sheepishly. Maybe? I don't know what this means. I don't know if I want to know. I definitely know I can't talk to her until I've talked to the order and found out. But what I just want to say is if she tries to use this information against us or to get something she wants, just don't don't let her. I'm going to say the same thing to Jai. You're okay with us stopping her. We're not on the same side. I don't know who she is to me. I need... And I just... If we're not Ko fighting for the same. face of that man you saw. I don't know him. I just want to I... give you those chances to prepare yourself. Hmm. I'm going to try. I'm trying to be a seeker and no but one else. If you recognize that there's a place that you need help, we're here... I didn't feel right not telling you. So. Now you know. You know as much as I do at this point. Thank you. Thank you. There's this look of 100% dawning recognition on Kaiming's <laughs> face, but then she keeps her mouth shut. Mm. When we get back to Republic City, I need to speak to my order. And I'd like to speak to Jai just so that 
he isn't blindsided by any of this either. And I'd like to visit Chu, one of the Hot Rocks triads that ended up in prison. Why? Um, because he might know more information on how I can find the library. He might have some training that I can use. Where's this coming from? Like... Well, I met Jai's <coughs> old mentor, Mazin, while I was at the Midway. Oh. And he gave me a hint. I see. While you were off with them. With your friend. You don't have to. Okay. You didn't exactly strike me as helpful, but if we're up in Takata, maybe we can up and we can negotiate with him or something. Okay. In the meantime, like I said, we need her, and I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out of her, Takata. No, um, I think there's also the Inquisitor that's looking into my family. They might know something, they might find something, but I don't know if they'll talk to me as I am a son. I'm not. I don't know how I'm going to convince this guy to tell me anything. I don't know how we're going to do anything, but I think we all know what he's doing. Yeah. That's sort of how I live my entire life. Go for a low high five. Oh, okay. She goes for it. Okay. Do you do you yank it out? No, 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 not at all. I just, I just. There was a pause, <laughs> and I was like, "Low, are you gonna... were? Uh, I value my life, so no, I do not. <laughs> I'll kill you. <laughs> oh my god. They won't find your head. <laughs> oh my god. No, sure, we locked up the wrong sister. <laughs> locked up the wrong sister this whole time. Perfect. Going to keep saying what people want me to say. I just wanted you guys to know. Actually made. We understand. You're really impressive. The way you talked to your parents and Kaisuke, and it just felt like you knew exactly what all of them needed to hear. And you were just able to be that person for them all the time. That's what I was trained for. You were trained for spirits, and you seemed effortless in the spirit world. That's not as wholesome, I would think. Look! Huh? Kaiming points out the window, and you can see Republic City on the far horizon. It's very... Because this doesn't do anything. It's, it's, it's very small, and you're very high up. Right. Have you ridden in an airship before? Uh, no. No. Maybe. Let's, let's I'm rich enough. Probably. probably. I'm rich enough. Yeah. <laughs> I designed the stabilizers on this airship. Oh my god. It's honestly possible. Yeah. Probably take, took one out for a joyride at some point. Sweet. Where are you two, or all four of you, where are you all going to stay in Republic City? Do you want? Do you want me to arrange some rooms at the temple for you? Close to the spirit portal. That way we can't be we can't be said to be shirking our duties. That's where we're supposed to go. Exactly. If there's space for us. I would appreciate a place to stay. I otherwise don't know where I'd go. Of course. I'll arrange I, it. I have an apartment. Would you okay? It's it's I mean tea shop. I I hope it's still there. There was there was fire when we were last there, but I don't remember whether it had destroyed it or anything. That, that, that's out of character. Mm -hmm. I just don't remember what happened to our tea shop. I think it's okay. Okay, yeah. great. Yeah. Then tea shop, also an option. Mm -hmm. Sweet. It'd be more private. Yeah. Is that okay for you? I have to stay at the temple, but you yeah. all stay wherever you want. If you need me to arrange rooms, I'll, I will. No, let's get our old home base back. And then I motion to Naota with a new outfit in tow. The last time you were at your place, didn't you get arrested there? I'm not going back to that cupboard under the stairs where I used to live. <laughs> I never had much clout in Republic City. You know? 
thought you were a member of the Hot Rocks Triad. That's... But you worked with them. You yeah, 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 that's... Uh, that's not earned status. That's taken. You know? I didn't like having to do that. But needed to. We all needed to. The ship starts to descend. We're going to see you soon. Really soon. Yeah. Good luck, everyone. Mm, sploosh. Oh. Everyone dies. Oh, oh. Shit. yay! Oh. Well, blast. Surprise. Game over. Uh, so, the stable alarm. As the ship starts to descend into um, Republic City, my main looks up. Um, you can use my apartment, but I, I'm going to have to stay wherever... Takata puts me. Yeah. So I'm going to have to say goodbye to you for a little bit. But I'll get you messages as quick as I can. And I feel like they'll probably want you to have some contact with the temple. So we'll be sure to keep in touch. Okay. Um, I guess I'll see you later. I mean, yeah. You think you can try to persuade Takata to give me my staff? She's gonna want something in exchange. I don't have much to offer, other than my loyalty. Don't give her anything of yours. I don't have anything to give. I don't know what Sayla has. Bad attitude. <clears throat> well, a headache at the moment. Good. I'll. I think I know what to do. Uh, why don't you come with me? And then she grabs you oh. by the vest. I was going to say the shirt. What shirt? Mm -hmm. Hey. Grabs you by the vest. Rows you like out of the room, not like onto the ground, but just sort of like, okay. uh, and then just starts marching you out towards the deck. Uh, Young Sue's going to put up a bit of a show of like, hey, come on. Hey, come get, out, get off me. She gets onto the bridge. Um, and Jai's like, what? What is going on? As this one keeps asking for his staff back, says that it's necessary if he's going to go into the spirit realm. How am I supposed to defend myself? I don't care. Give him his staff back. Thank you, Commander. And I turn to Sela. Your commanding officer commands you. You're going to have to be the one to explain this to Takata, and then. She pulls the staff and hands it to you. I... It's just a stick anyway. It's not. It's not just a... Thanks for nothing. Whatever, I don't want to see you again. Uh, there's there's like a real moment of like, what? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> on, on his face and then it, he, he wipes it away. It'll be too soon if we ever do. Get off the bridge. Uh, this is my bridge. <laughs> and then the captain goes, no, this is my bridge. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> All right. Oh, hey, captain, hey. you're here. No, this is mine. Uh, uh, Young Su yeah. uh, leaves the bridge, albeit with a little like me. Coming does not follow you. But as you leave, she turns and then just folds her arms, the silhouette, a very recognizable silhouette of a Kyoshi warrior just standing on the bridge, looking out as the city grows and grows in the windows. <laughs> I was like, in the viewfinder? <laughs> they don't really have those. <laughs> uh, I'm going to quickly, before we go, I'm going to... Uh, Probably can't. Uh, yes, I can. I could probably get back to where Kaiming Kaiming is storing her things. Mm -hmm. I would like to leave a note that just says, "I owe you one hug," and flip it in her things. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> cool, cool. All right. Anything else? As the ship starts coming in for a landing, uh, you're warned. You know, stay in your state rooms. We will once we have come to a complete stop. You will be able to blah 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 blah. Until eventually, uh, you are given the chance to disembark. 
Standing, however, at the port, the dock, mm. where everything is, there are dozens of cameras. Oh. Report. Shit. And standing at the at the forefront of all this, you see uh, a a man who's dressed in uh, water tribe blue. It's a very it's an impeccable looking suit, uh, uh, with his chin thrust upwards as you step off the. Don is trying really hard to stay out of sight, to not be seen. Not be seen? Yeah. How are you trying to do that? Uh, she's trying to get herself lost in the crowd. She's crouching so down a little bit. Just stand and like, bend it in front of your face? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's blur, or like, blur it for the camera. That would be really good, actually. Yeah, kind of amazing. You could, you could wear a hood or something. She's still wearing Jai's clothes and oh. is feeling like this is not good. So she's trying ah. to be... You're not wearing your silver robes, though. That's good. Is sneaking around uh, part of your skills and training? I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. So... This seems like you're pushing your luck. Cool. So I'm going to ask you to push your luck here. So I, you can roll with Sion. I cannot help with this. No. Just because I'm out of the team. But I do have, well, not action, but you know. It's 12. Okay. Okay. Wow. <laughs> All right. So wow. uh, this... There is going to be a cost for you to scrape by. However, you are going to get a lucky opportunity that falls in your lap. Ooh. Uh, as you start to disembark, you're clearly trying to like... Keep a low profile. Keep a low profile, which means that they don't notice you. And then the man in the blue suit walks up and immediately thrusts his hands out towards uh, Young Su and Bao. Now these are the two that I was looking for. I'm sorry, we don't have any comment at this time. Your name, good sir. My name? Bow extends a hand to shake. Well, you are the ones who managed to save my ship. Or at least the people on it. I, I'm i so sorry. We we do have comments at this time. <laughs> uh, young Sue bows his head. And You're a legend. Beric plants one hand on either of your oh. shoulders and just rotates you wow. around to face the cameras and flings his arms around the two of them. These two are the heroes that made sure that we managed to save every single life on that ship. Hey, where's your friend? We we had help, but um, she's otherwise occupied at this moment. Mm -hmm. Otherwise occupied? I thought the three of you were thick as thieves. Joined at the hip. Doesn't mean that she can't have her own matters to attend to. There might be others who need saving. Good. How often do people need sa- uh, Never mind. Listen. The thing, too, was the safest thing on the seas. Until it wasn't. But the two of you <laughs> managed to keep things going as much as possible until we could rescue every last one of them. And we thought that we'd lost you. There. Mm -hmm. we, we were lucky. We... We had a lot of help, Beric, sir. It was it was a team effort from everyone on board. Well, it's too bad that your friend can't join us for the magnificent feast that I have planned for us. Mm. And he starts walking the two of you. Takata exits the ship and there's like a, uh, and then <laughs> the, the reporters just rush in for her and Beric has separated the two of you. Oh, man. Three no, of you. I'm now is there. Okay. I'm gonna like glance over my shoulder towards Bow, like where I thought I last saw Don. Uh, but at the same time, Joy. yeah. <laughs> like, I think I just bought her time to do what she needs to do, so. Yo. <laughs> you, however, are picked up by uh, a police officer who is working security here at the dock. Hey, are you all right? I am heading for the Temple of the Order of Passage. Uh,. You just, and then you're, but you're not going with... No. I have urgent seeker matters to attend to. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I'm sorry, is there a problem? What's Ooh. a seeker? I'll tell you one day. No, you won't. This is the last time we'll ever speak. A seeker is the highest ranking position short of the guide at the Order of Passage. I'm very important, and I was appointed by the spirits themselves. Okay. Now I really need to go. It's the Order of Passage. <laughs> Lady, do I look like I give any... You asked. Or... I have to go. May I go? I think I'm going to need to see some identification, please. Because clearly you're wearing a Fire Nation Army outfit. Uh... She digs around for something. She probably has something. Sand? A lot of sand. Yeah. Can you imagine? How about this? You could show off sand bending. That would be indicative that you're probably not a Fire Nation soldier. I am not Fire Nation. Ooh, sand everywhere. Please, may I go? Am I under arrest? I'm a crime bender. <laughs> Tell you what. You need to get to this order of passage? Yes. I'll take you. Great. And he opens up the back of his police mobile. Yes. It's not that far. I would rather we walk. I can't leave my police Then drive here. alongside me, please. You would rather that I just drive alongside? Yes. Isn't that more conspicuous than you just taking a ride in the car? I don't want to get in the back of your car if I'm not under arrest. Well, maybe I'll put you under arrest. For what? I've had a really long voyage. I really need to get back to the order. They can vouch for me. Yating, the guide there, knows who I am. Everyone there knows who I am. I didn't want to be harangued by the press. Right. But I'm watching you. Okay, watch me. Watch me walk away. She's just, just, just like, oh my god, I'm so bad at this. <laughs> She's leaving. So as you start walking towards the order, the police officer starts crawling the car. Uh, just, woo! oh no, there's no, there's no lights. There's okay, no lights. Just, just, it very clearly like, <laughs> quick, walk faster, Don. Incredible. And then you get to the temple itself. She turns to to look at him and goes like this to show that she's going inside. Fucking guy. And then she heads up the steps. Uh, when you manage to make it up the steps towards the temple, uh, there's uh, attendants who are just cleaning everywhere we're talking like mopping the floors dusting shelves reaching under sacred artifacts to make sure that there's no dust under the sacred artifacts like way more than they normally would be i mean they're a bunch of sand vendors they don't care that much about dust dust is sort of like their weapon <laughs> oh that'd be powerful in my house if by some miracle nobody notices Don, she's gonna try to go straight to her room to they, change. They don't because you're not wearing what you would normally would. She power walks Ooh. towards her room. Uh, miss, you can't Aww. go back there. And you turn around and it, oh, that's not somebody you recognize. They're wearing the robe of an acolyte. So like the lowest level. Yeah. Uh, but no, that's not somebody you know. I am here to speak to Yating. Yating is very busy. Could you let them know the Seeker is here to see them? Nice try. But the Seeker is in his chambers over there. The other Seeker. What other Seeker? And then... At this point, two of the other acolytes stop and there's like a... <gasps> what do you mean the other seeker? The one who was supposed to have died in a shipwreck. And then the two other acolytes rush over and they just elbow this person out of the way and then goes, oh, you're here, you're yeah. here. Let's, here, come to your, let's go to your room, go to your room. And they, they just <sighs> like muscle you away. And this other person's like, what? I didn't. Uh, sorry. They're, uh, 
No, of course. I've been gone a long time. No, well, I mean, a week. Maybe two? Yeah. I can't keep track of It doesn't feel like times. that long, but... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sure Seems... Like, it's, it t- definitely hasn't been more than a month. Mm-hmm. Okay. Observer. Observer. There's so many new people here. There's a lot of things that have changed in the past couple of weeks. Is everyone okay? Well, everything's fine. We're finally out of financial jeopardy. Ah. I imagine the councilwoman has been helping a great deal. Oh, we haven't seen the councilwoman. But there's been an investment. Oh, really? From who? Um. The, uh. Sawan clan? Is that it? Is that the right name? Yeah, they're, um... Do you know them? I know some of them. Yes. Uh, they're, 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 they're a few members of the Sawan clan were on the, the spirit walk that I led before oh. I left. Yes. Uh, well, uh, there were, uh, concerns from another clan and then, um, the Sawan clan came in and we, they've given us everything that we've needed to stay operational for another five years. Five years. Oh. Yeah. It's incredible. Look, we even have new robes for you. What do the robes look like? Just the same. Okay. The <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's hidden on the inside. By. It's the real floor in property. Of- yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> right. Well, I will. You're get- so. Here, let's let's do something about this. And they start pulling out like a foot bath uh, and pumice stones and uh, nail files. Um, uh, if it's okay, can I just have a, a moment just to? Um. But you want to see uh, Ting? Yes. Could you let them know that I'm I'm back and I would like to see them as soon as possible. I, I'll get changed. Well, yes, but they. They'll they'll expect you to be wearing and, and, and yes yes I'll just I'll just get changed myself is that okay? Well, okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hey, why did you need a police escort to get here? I wasn't dressed the way they expected a seeker to be dressed, so there was some questions and wanted to ensure my safety and security and oh. all of that. That seems weird. Okay. Bye. Bye. Uh, Don has been calling them by their proper names this whole time. Yeah, they don't right. have names. Great, wonderful. Yeah. Um, <laughs> they, they gave them up. They gave them up. They're, they're just like, <laughs> Fabulous. Oh. My new name is Knowledge. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, as soon as they're gone, she she closes the door very quickly and just like... Your room is just as you left it. <laughs> Except... Uh, <laughs> I also was like... like yeah. <laughs> uh, she just takes like a few breaths and then like, starts getting changed folds the clothing lent by Jai very neatly it still smells like him a little bit Damn it. I don't know. Not if the two of you are being pulled away uh, now listen it's my intention to make sure that you get your just desserts a reward after all, the ship went down. But you wouldn't believe what we learned so that we can make sure that the Thing 3, now that is going to be the marvel of the seas. What did you learn? Did you know that somebody deliberately sabotaged the Thing with technology that I invented? No. We were suspecting that might be the case. The Thing 2 seemed far too powerful to just come apart on its own. You know what? One second. And he turns to this, like, tiny, schlubby little guy. Yeah. He goes, make sure that we're not interrupted. <sighs> Do the thing. And he's like, oh, yes, okay. Oh, the thing, okay. And starts guiding all the reporters who are like, blah, 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 blah. And then closes, and you're in, a, in an opulent Incredible. office. Can't believe it. You wouldn't believe how hard it is to get Takata away from you. Mr. Varric, sir. Thank you for recognizing that. Yes. What did you do to piss her off? Uh, a little. That's right. In this universe, I say piss. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Yay! It's the Cave Johnson of... Anyway. Uh... 
um, a little light property damage. Um, that was just me, though. That's not on anybody else. Yeah, we're all aware of your criminal record. That's not nearly enough. Okay. Um, Listen, you did save the ship, but the ship was sabotaged. Other people don't know about it yet. But I assume that you might have more information about it. What happened to my ship? So, there's a boom. Clearly it must have been one of these bombs. Um... There were a bunch of waterbenders recruited to try to keep it um, afloat, mm -hmm. right? Try to block it. Of course, uh, the ship's complement makes sure that there's at least five waterbenders on staff. There were other individuals that were spotted leaving on their own separate boat um, that seemed to be involved with the kidnap with the with the sabotage. Half of the lifeboats had been sabotaged. If That's it wasn't right. for our friend on. People wouldn't have gotten away. We have reason to believe that this was done. Sabotage. Exactly. The engines were slightly longer technical description of what was done to them, uh, and the hulls were damaged. Communications equipment sabotaged. Yeah. As well. Somebody didn't want some of us getting off the thing, too. Wait a minute. I thought you were a pro bender. No, I mean, I can bend, but yeah, I was could. <laughs> briefly recruited, but that ship sank, so to speak. Mr. Varick, sir, the pro-benders who were there, we have reason to suspect, great reason to suspect, that at least one of them is in league with Takata and may have even set this bomb. I can't prove anything until we find her again. I have to say, I'm not pleased. And at the same time, I'm thrilled! The two of you are alive! <laughs> oh, thank you, Mr. Varick, sir. Thank and you're telling me that your friend, Don, she's alive too? Yes. Just keeping a somewhat more low profile right now. And wasn't there a Kyoshi warrior with you? There was. She's safe too. Well, where is she? You'll have to excuse us, Mr. Varick, sir. We gotta keep some things close to our chest. Well, Twins, understand. switcheroo, it's complicated. <laughs> I, it's, yeah. I could understand that the Sawan here needed to keep things close to their chest, but you, everything close to your chest is visible to everyone to see. Mm. Have you ever heard of this thing? It's an invention. It's called a shirt. <laughs> Touche. Touche, Mr. At Barry. the same time. I can understand. It looks you know, down a little bit. Are you going to sleep yes. with the barrack? <laughs> America Global <laughs> Industries? Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, right, right, we're back, we're back. So, this does provide us an opportunity to find out what happened to your ship, take down whoever it is that took down your ship, uh, and make sure that um, people like the councilwoman don't stand in your way. You find out what happened to my ship, and you somehow managed to tie this to Takata, and I'm going to owe you a favor. And that's favor with a capital F. That's a, that's a lot. We would love to do that. Now, how can I help? And he leans forward. <laughs> There's hey, a kid. Yeah. I think you might have a career in the movers. No, I'm not much of an actor. Oh, who, who me? I'm not much of an actor. Your stomach says otherwise. <laughs> it immediately growls. Uh, uh, sorry. There's food there was... everywhere. Oh, bro, oh, thank God. Um, <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> So, yeah, one of the people that we think that might have been involved was one of the other pro-benders. Her name was Bashira. Have you heard any talk about um, the other members of the pro-bending team that were on that ship? If we can find Bashira, Mr. Varick, sir, we'll be able to provide that proof tying it to Takata. And then, well, yeah, and there you go. go and let me just say again mr varick sir i'm so sorry that all of this happened i i don't know why someone would target the thing too specifically you're obviously very powerful and important but the manager of the unagis as well what he, well he was tied up he was targeted he was left to die on the ship 
the manager of the Unagis, Go, I assume, handpicked by... No, Go is fine. Yeah. That's how I know that it was you. Okay, well, right, good thing that he's the fine. the fact that he got tied up by someone, like, it's... He didn't mention that. Yeah. I mean, listen, what people do in their state rooms, usually it's none of my concern. <laughs> it didn't seem that kind of situation. So it wasn't you. No. And it wasn't consensual. Not that we're aware of. We can find this firebender, this ex-fire sage, this Shira, if she's here in Republic City, we'll get you your proof. Well, of course she's here. She's going to go alive in a pro-bending match in a couple of days. Excellent. Do all the teams have airbenders? Well, we were looking for one. We do, can't find one. Do all the teams have water boys? Not water benders, like to carry cowboys. Typically, water benders don't need water boys or water girls for that matter. That's true. Cowboys? Towel? Towel? You're a towel bender? <laughs> Honestly, I bet a he can crack a bean bend. towel. I, oh, yeah. Oh, he yeah. To, With like, this three sections down? Yeah, yeah. Holy shit, I must be an expert. Um, You're uh, an airbender. Comfy yeah. Fenders. For what it's worth, Varric's stats are released. Uh, it's in Wanchi. It's in oh. Wanchi Tong's adventure guide. Mm -hmm. uh, ah, that's he right. is one of the NPC legends that you can find in play. Uh, he's on page forty-six. So then, if she's playing, does her team still is still looking for an airbender? Well, we're still trying to find one. Like I said, we have a couple of days. At the same time. I'm not going to be able to hold on to you forever. You are currently wanted by the police, if not Takata. Takata has said that you're headed out, out into the spirit world tomorrow. We have to get to Bashira fast. Well, that's something that I can do. I can just invite her here. I'll join your team. <laughs> well, just hold up a second. I don't really need my team tearing each other apart. But if you say if she that Bashir is one of the saboteurs, to sink your well, I don't want her on the team anymore, do I? Correct. Well, now I'm going to need another firebender. I know one that's way too busy. Hold on. <laughs> I'm, I'm from the Fire Nation. I can name you the top ten benders of my generation. I'm sure at least one of them would want to join your team. So it's pacing back and forth. You know, this was a lot easier when I had better help. Sometimes... Better help is so better that they can no longer... Look, my wife went and got herself the president of this entire damn <laughs> yeah. place. I say damn in this universe, too. Woo! Yeah! Love that. Love that for him. And that's very impressive, Mr. Barrett, sir. So... Kata said she's going to be more powerful than a councilwoman. You should... I know she's extremely competent, but... If... Cat is making moves to climb the ladder. Your wife is on top of that ladder. Well, now my ship has been destroyed. My pro bending team is responsible. And they're coming for my wife? Listen, before this was edging on personal. Now I'm pretty sure that it falls pretty squarely in the this might be personal. Very much. If you can get us to meet with Bashira, uh, I think that would help us get to the bottom of this. Because if she didn't do it, I'm sure she'll want to convince us of that. Yeah. And help us find who it was. Mm -hmm. Forget about that. I need to hire you. Oh. For a pro bending, we don't have time for. Listen. Ever since I started dealing with all the other different nations, every once in a while a family name would come up, somebody who I absolutely had to meet. You, on the other hand, you represent the Sawan clan. Yes. Listen, I don't mean to be rude. The Sawan clan's got a lot of forward-thinking ideas and a lot of weights tied around their ankles and they're being dangled directly in front of the ocean, if you know what I'm talking about here. Yes. Sweet Jesus. What are you doing with them? Come work for me. I'll give you a whole lab. Hey, I hear you're an airbender. Yes. 
hence my volunteering whoosh, to work for a year. Yeah. Whoosh, yeah. yeah. They they had done this before when uh, they're like hire me. I, yeah. yeah. One hundred percent. I I am Yeah, yeah. I yeah. Know this. <laughs> no, I just wanted to make sure because you're also doing other stuff. Oh, um That's right, I'm the yeah. first gentleman. Yeah, first gentleman. Amazing. Um <laughs> Yes. Whoosh. So, um I'm very interested in discussing business dealings between myself and you and possibly even my family and you. Of course, but this isn't the time for business dealings. We have to figure out what happened to the ship. Yes. Right, right of course, Mr. Varick, sir. Let's get Bashira here. We'll take care of the rest. Bless you. All right. Hey, listen. You're from the Earth Kingdom, but do you like sea prunes? Uh, there's a dessert that goes with sea prunes. It's magnificent. I know just the guy to get it. Oh, you don't happen to already have any here, I guess. Just mightn't I. Anyway. Hey! Oh, sorry. Xdo! Oh, no. And that same schlub comes in. I'm going to need dinner. Dinner for uh, Bashira. And um, you make sure my wife isn't present and um, get the dessert I like and the dessert he likes. And uh, this is Sawan Bao. You <laughs> make sure that Sawan Bao is everything they need. Do the thing. And the guy's like, oh, okay, oh, okay. Right. I got it. Turns around. Just doesn't have the same kick anymore. Mm. Incidentally, uh, Kung Fu Fenders is correct. He could teach you the maneuver, do the thing. That's amazing. It's that a is. rare technique. <laughs> rare! Oh my god. <laughs> where you can mark two fatigue to allow one ally to immediately use one technique from any approach. That's incredible. Wow. Right. Any approach. I like to just shout do the thing that someone oh, I like the concept that if you start raising your hand you could also just blot my face out from the screen <laughs> ah. amazing do the thing yeah Yating is in their office uh, Don walks in looking more like a seeker than she has in weeks. She's wearing the robes are pristine and she's tidied her hair a bit. These robes fit a little better than the previous ones. Huh. Um. Hi. Where have you been? Ultra had to go away for a bit. Just went on a bit longer than I thought. They get up and they go around their desk, walk forward, size you up. That's not some little thing, is it? No. Um, a lot has happened and we're not through it yet. But I, I missed a lot. You, I need to know what the orders agreed upon with Takata. Why are, why are we working with the councilwoman? Why is, why are the Sawan financing us? What happened? Do you think it's easy for us to maintain this kind of temple in Republic City? One of the tenets of our order is that those who seek knowledge should be able to find it. And we charge, but there's only so much that we're able to allow ourselves to ask for. We've been operating in the red for a long time. Why didn't you tell me? Because that's not your place. You're a seeker. You're seeking knowledge, not balancing books. <laughs> okay, so we've been struggling, and suddenly this clan comes along and they're able to make all our problems disappear in exchange for what? In exchange for what? Regular access to seekings. 
the promise that if we find certain elements in the spirit world that they will be granted first audience. What do you mean? Relics or, or resources or... Yes. One of our tenets is to protect and safeguard spirit world relics. Yes, and they will be protected and safeguarded. But not by us, by them. No, by us. But they'll have a chance to consult first before anyone else. We don't have to tell them everything that we find. Sounds like that's what you've agreed to. There are certain things that we have to agree to. Yating, this order was founded... The order was founded years ago, when we still had access to Wan Chitong's library. We don't anymore. We will! How? Give me leave to go and find it. It's that simple? It might be. I have a lead. I have a trail that I can follow for the first time ever, rather than waiting Stop. for it to come to a- Please let me go and find it, Yating! You disappear for weeks. You come back. I've been covering for you this entire time. And I appreciate it, I do. Even when people said that you were dead. I said, no, impossible. But we would have had another seeking. We would have had a fox spirit show up. None came. So I knew you were still alive. And yet you come back here and the first thing that you have to say is that whatever the order has demanded, it's not good enough for you. And now you need to leave us again. No. So that you can go and find the thing that we haven't found in over a hundred years. I know I'm asking a lot. Technically not over a hundred years. More like 50. Mm. I know. Shit. <laughs> I know that this is hard to understand, but I, we can't wait for Wan Shitong to come to us. We need to seek it out. I should have been doing this years ago. I didn't know, and I, we didn't know. This arrangement that is happening with the Sawan. Councilwoman Takata is involved, and her interests are not Yes, good. and that is why we have been hired to accompany Takata's first incursion into the spirit world. You will be accompanying that first delegation. And where does it end? You know that she plans to have people settle there, right? She wants to occupy the spirit world. She doesn't just want to visit whenever she wants. Would you rather the order collapse? And so that then all of the relics that we protect, all of the knowledge that we hold on to, and if we do find the library, you want it to fall into anyone's hands instead of us? I'm looking at our long-term survival, and that's what you should be doing too. I'm trying to keep hold of why we were founded in the first place. This isn't... If we're us. not the order that we claim to be, why are we... This isn't us laughing over a date that one of us had or letting each other sneak out so that we can buy dessert. This is what we have to do. This is the role that we were both born into that we have to play. No, I was selected by the spirits. And you're about to topple off the edge of your balance meter. So, okay. So, yeah. do you want that to happen? Because if you don't, if you do, there's a very specific thing that happens here. Yeah. So. But it's not necessarily a bad thing for you. <laughs> Here's the deal with balance. Okay. Let's just uh, hold this up here. <sighs> okay. All right. That was that was my next question. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Your balance here. Let's let's call it up here. So we can see it. Uh, your center will shift one to the right. Mm -hmm. You will take action that ha goes beyond uh, a, let's say, a, a normal rational discourse. 
Uh, but it won't happen during combat, so it can't be used to force you out of combat. You will reset normally. Where is the damn thing here? It's under moves. It's under moves? I it Where? Sorry? I pulled it up, and it's a uh, balance move, so it's... Uh... Yeah, so you'll have to either give in or submit, lose control of yourself in a destructive and harmful way, or take an extreme action in line with the principle, and then flee. So, here's the thing. Mm -hmm. I'm giving you four options. Okay. One of those three, or you're going to have to tone down the rhetoric and it, at least... Well, in fact, that would be giving in and submitting to your opposition, and then you'll have to do at least one thing that Yating tells you to do. This is so hard because it's my own fault. Like, coming up with Don... Her being named by the spirits rather than by the order themselves creates means that when she's following what she believes to be her calling, mm. she's going against the order. Mm. And yet she feels like she's still doing what she's being called to do. So it's ah, it's so tricky. So I, I don't the, yeah. I felt do you need a moment to think about it? I I mean, are we okay to talk it out a little bit, we, actually? We totally yeah, I think I could totally I could use that. I definitely felt that way with tradition and progress. Tradition is everything my family does. Yeah. But often the way I choose to use it moves me towards progress. But I think that's kind of the point of most of these, that the duality isn't completely like different directions. They're two sides of the same coin. So yeah, like, that's it. So yeah. it's, it's definitely, because she doesn't feel like she's, she doesn't feel like she's going against the order right now. She so, feels like she's, she's actually looking out for them by doing what but you're she's breaking the tradition of the order that's the key yeah. your freedom doesn't mean i don't want to be part of the order anymore freedom yeah. is i want the freedom to choose how i act even if i'm in support of this thing that's important to me tradition role. yeah mm -hmm. tradition mm -hmm. or role is yeting saying you need to just shut up and be a seeker right now because that's what the order needs of you. Mm -hmm. And you are saying, but I have something that might help the order, but it means that I can't do what I'm told to do. Yeah. So that's why you're being shifted off your balance here. Uh, okay. Now I'll need time to think about it. All right. Thanks, folks. However, just call me back if you need to. Okay. <laughs> Hello? Uh, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to shift the two of you forward in time and she is going to stay behind. Mm -hmm. Okay? So for now, you can't reach her. Let's go to the temple. <laughs> yeah, immediately. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're slowing down. Yeah. Because it's dinner time. It's dinner. Or shortly before dinner time if oh. you want to. So Varric at yeah. some point just like stops ranting at you yeah. and then says, I have to take care of a few things. And then yeah. he leaves. <laughs> so you are now the three of you alone because now is still with you. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Bow definitely looks at some. I feel like he's got a lot of doohickeys and gizmos lying about his office. Oh yeah. Yeah, Bow God, definitely. It's all fascinating. Gravitates shit. towards one of the things and is fiddling with it uh, and thinking, but like definitely. I've only got one question: Are we gonna play nice with Bashira, or not even bother? So as you're fiddling with this thing, yeah. one thing that you can see is that it seems to be remotely controlling something from across the room. It's just a light that goes on or off. Hmm. The kind of question, quote unquote, directed to both Bao and now. Because I see we could try. We could try to be nice. It's very possible that she's been taken in by Takata's uh, vision of the future, whatever that is. But maybe with the proper application of showing her that we mean business, she'll flip. The last firebender I tried to convince while they were in a, between a rock and a hard place almost blew me up in a sumner shark. Not untrue. Oh, get down! Yeah, we all just, yeah, we were backflip. Perfect. Mr. President. You can't be hurt if we're in the middle of a backflip. Cool. Yeah. 
Yeah. Just remember, in Avatar, nobody has ever been hurt in the middle of a battle before. Look, it's like the Matrix. You just gotta do the little, like, like you know, people only shoot bullets at one height. Mm -hmm. They don't realize that all these people always do the same move, so they don't try to shoot their knees out or anything. Right, of course. No, no, no. no. Flower of August, they're sending messages to us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's just being automatically removed from chat. Um, oh yeah so the last time you tried to oh yeah, yeah yeah so i think we Don't need to at least sure. start with the friendly approach and then if she sucks <laughs> two elite warriors on my side you've got your weapon back so you're actually fully elite rather than just really good that's very very kind Val. did she um i don't know did bashira like you when you had your training on the thing too? I mean, she bought me a strong drink. But maybe she bought me that strong drink so that I'd be- She bought you a drink. I also raised my eyebrow for now's benefit. Unconscious mm -hmm. or drunk when the ship went down. So, you know. Oh. Was it friendly? Was it scheming? Good question. You're a master of deception. Now, Oda, what do you think? Deception? Aren't you? Have I ever presented myself as anything other than a bounty hunter? True. Uh, except for... What? One <laughs> sword for... Yes. Yes. Um, yes. <laughs> I... Hmm. I never got to do much consulting. It was very... Never mind. What? We'll just, we can't we can't trust Bashira but you're right we're here we need to make it not seem like a trap that she's walking into right yeah and again if we can get her talking maybe she'll even spill more beans about her connections to Takata of rather than just admitting to the sabotage right, right. If we can get more and more and more out of her just have to figure out what she wants and promise it. Immunity. Yeah. 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 Why would she need anything other than immunity? Maybe Takata promised that, you know, her lover would be taken out of jail. Maybe. Perhaps, but okay. your testimony at the moment puts her directly in line with saboteurs. Anybody sabotaging one of the ships is in grave danger of just being thrown away. Hmm. Forever. I don't know if we can promise immunity. Necessarily. Oh, I think we have a friend in a very high place right now, gesturing to the office. Mm -hmm. And he has the ear of someone in an even higher place. That is true. He said he'd help. He said he wanted to know what happened. He wanted to get to the bottom of it. I think he'll use the resources at his disposal to do so. If it seems like she'll be more open to speaking with us if we are part of the Councilwoman's plan, I'm okay to go with that angle as well. If we need to. Mm -mm. But you're right. If we can offer her a chance, a chance to be on the side that is going to be victorious in this conflict, a chance to be on the side of, well, not blowing up ships and invading the spirit world. The door bursts open. Oh, sh invading the spirit world. Varric walks in and closes the door. God damn it. <laughs> what, you don't think that I can hear everything that happens inside my office? I can't. Oh, but I was just outside the door and therefore I could hear exactly what you were saying. Val uses a little bit of air bending to scooch the thing she was playing with back right where it was. <laughs> Varric. Does not notice. Ah, uh, yes! I wasn't touching this. Take <laughs> that, <laughs> legend. Uh, oh, God. It is true that if we decided to fight Varric, it would be a pretty difficult fight. <laughs> well, you know, he's got a bunch of crazy shit. Wily. He's wily. He's very wily. One of his conditions is manic. <laughs> Amazing and accurate. <laughs> and also very accurate, yeah. Good job, 100%. game designers. Creators, etc. Uh, they are, in fact, I will just... Say yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah just, just out of curiosity. Uh, Varric's sheet, his conditions are afraid, angry, guilty, insecure, troubled. 
manic, frustrated, and disappointed. Incredible. Oh, amazing. I really like that the more powerful you are, the more like negative you can feel. You know what well, I mean? That's kind of like extra health levels because yeah. you need like a maximum of conditions before you're. It's true, right? He has 15 so. fatigue to spend. And yeah, also, he has, his principle <laughs> is creativity. Yeah. Makes yeah. sense. That makes that's great. That's his cool. drive is to build a better, brighter future with strobe lights and crackling electrodes <laughs> for the United Republic of Nations in the world. Oh, so good. This guy's the best. So good. Um, we were just saying that, Mr. Varric, sir, we can try to convince Bashira to be on the side of right, not on the side of. Well, the invasion. I need Bashira sure to be on the side of right. Right. And the side of right, right now, is right off the roof. No, 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 uh, Mr. Barrick, sir, we don't. No, we're thinking that if we can get her to talk, she'll be more likely to keep talking if we are dangling her off the side of the roof. You're saying that maybe we can leverage her. And if she comes over to our side, she can still be your pro-bender. Well, I don't care that much about pro-bending right now. I need, to, I need to worry about the ship. Right. Yes. The thing three has to go off without a hitch. Yes. You don't even want to know what happened to the thing one. We all have prototypes. I'm looking at, yeah, I'm, I'm like, I do. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> God, so good. Could you stop swooning over Asami for a second? No, oh, sorry, no. I, I actually I actively can't, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, if you bring her into the campaign, like, the campaign's just going to grind to a halt. Bleach. Oh my god, who flooded he Republic City? Everywhere. <laughs> yeah, you faint over Asami. The next thing you know, Korra's gonna be in here and her mitts are gonna be all up in your face. <laughs> She'll take your bending and your life. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh boy. Right. Okay. Yeah, exactly. We can try to leverage her. We're gonna have a nice dinner together. Exactly. Excellent. Are you going to be in attendance, Mr. Varric, sir? No, you said you weren't. Never mind. Yes, of oh, course yes, I was. Oh, sorry. What are you talking about? I... We're in my office. Why? Well, I... You're not going to eat in here without me being here, are you? No. I don't rent this place out to. for parties. Put the half-eaten food down on the... <laughs> no, you can eat that... Sorry, yeah. Oh. <laughs> you remind me of somebody, and I don't remember his name. Ouch. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Listen. Tomorrow, I lose access to you, which means we're going to have to get as much as we can get done tonight. Okay? Okay. We can do this. We can do this. You can do this. We will do this. Yeah, together. I believe in you. Especially because this is going to be extremely lucrative for both of us. And by yeah. both of us, I mean all of us. And by all of us, I mean you two. I have no idea who this person is. Oh, wait, no, you helped too. Uh, you're good. She was instrumental. Yeah. Right. But she's not Sawan. No. no. What do I need with the Oda clan? Nobody needs the Oda clan. Hey, it's nothing personal. <laughs> Now he goes to argue and then can't. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look, it's like the Toronto Montreal rivalry. Oh! I just it is. It's like, yeah, Toronto's fine or whatever, but I can't say that. Mm. I, but but Young Su in a low tone goes, I'm sure the Odos are very nice. I've never met any. Well, I've met a few, but I'm sure they're very nice. You've met one, at least. Yeah. Half yeah. dozen. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. You just met nice. I'm not Kaiming. Listen, ah. I'm sensing a little bit of a, hey, wait a minute. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to go make sure that Bashira gets here on time. You take a seat. Beric oh, leaves. Yeah. This is the point where I also remind you that you still have an outstanding debt to repay. I do have an outstanding debt to repay. Where are you in debt to? Jai. Oh, yes, to, of he course. He has to tell two people how he truly feels. One of them he has. Yeah. 
Yeah. The other one he has not yet. That's correct. Well, one of them he has twice. <laughs> Look. Bow, tell me about it later. You're welcome to ask Bow to go do something to, like, leave the room. No, don't leave! <laughs> no, no, it's... it's uh... <clears throat> Now you you're right. Um, I, I don't I don't wish you were Kaiming. I, I just wish Kaiming were here. She's cool, you know. I think you're pretty cool too. When we went into the spirit world together, I uh, I don't know. I I never met anyone like you before, and. Um, that was uh, really exciting, and it opened up a world of, I don't know, possibilities, imagination, dreams, in my mind. But, um, I just, I just want you to know because I feel that there's some tension between us. And what do you intend to do about that? tell you that I think you're going to be better off with someone who isn't me. Ah, uh, so you're making the decision. Yeah, I am. Is it that you believe that I would be better off with someone else, or that you would be better off with someone else? We. No, you don't get to make that decision for me. You're allowed to make it for yourself, and I respect that, and that's just fine. But you don't get to make the decision for me. As it stands, you're right. I thought so. Where do you get off saying that? <laughs> Bow is in the room. Yeah, of course. No, absolutely. Things. No, no, no. 100%. You don't get to decide things. You can't act smug. I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm acting smug. Oh, well, I thought so. Oh. Well. Anyway. No, no. Hang on. I want to have this out. You're right. That was a shitty thing for me to do. Okay? I'm not going to apologize for it. You because I'm going to apologize for something shitty that you've done. I want you to make your feelings known too. That's what I want you to do. Here, right now, before we lay a trap for Bashira. Yeah, I think that would be really not a good time for this, young Sue. That would be really bad to do right now. I would like both of you to know, because I don't think I've actually said this out loud, I promised Jai I would tell people how I feel, and every time I do that, every time I do that, something blows up in my face. And I know why it blows up in my face. Because I think every time that I'm going to have the right approach, ooh, I've tailor-made this approach for this person. No, Oda, I don't even know you that well. What am I supposed to say to you? You're competent. You're fucking sexy. Pardon my French. Okay? And I know that you inspired in me a vision of a future full of excitement. But I don't know you. So when I have to tell you something, I don't know how to do it. And I'm sorry that I don't know how to do something. You two are so good at doing things. I'm good at hitting people. And I'm good at telling people that I'm bad at stuff. That's what I'm really good at. See, now here's a real problem for you. Am I? You're now shifting off towards care. That's bad, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Could you bring up that, uh... Yeah. Can I... Oh, no. I was going to say, can I resist that? But no, I can't. No, you're because doing I'm not yourself. being shifted. Oh, wait, it's I true. I that because you said it. Was okay. Not my bad. Well, look briefly at what resisting What resisting about, could do. Uh, you know... You could have cleared a condition. Mm, you could have shifted nice. it. But unfortunately, you are shifting your own balance, really. This is Someone correct, yeah. So it, it doesn't actually... So unfortunately, we're going to look at uh, what happens when you do lose How dare you, Eric? Oh my god. So you can either give in and submit to your opposition. Okay. That's Bashira. Ooh, I don't like that. You can lose control of yourself in a destructive and harmful way, or you can take an extreme action in line with the principle and then flee. I can't flee. I'm part of this scene. <laughs> I'm part of the scene. Yeah. Like this scene, this trap. Leave. Yeah, you can totally leave. Woof. So I'm gonna let you think you. about this for but a second. I'm gonna pull myself back. Yes. 
where yeah, I should have fair. made a decision, right? You oh, think I'd boy. have a decision by now, but I have flip flopped. Very well. You know what? Stuff. This would probably be a good time. We're going to take a break. Oh, yeah, that sounds, sounds good. good. That sounds good. Five minute break. Uh, we're going to play some ads. We don't want to play ads. Otherwise, Twitch might play it in the middle of game, which mm. would suck. Uh, so if you are not a subscriber, you might see some ads. If you are a subscriber, feel free to stick around and ask some questions because we are going to take a five minute break. We'll be back shortly. Bye for those who are still gone. Bye. Don't you need anything? Nope. I will flash this green card. Yeah. And I will also flash it for Kate when. Yeah, play, play card, play on. It's a lot of it's a lot of emotion, oh, but I think it's God. a real emotion. There, there you go. I mean, woo. So I I actually want to talk it through with you. Okay without necessarily advertising it on the stream. So is you want that, me to get up and leave? Is it possible if we have yeah, a chat? Are you okay fan Yes, I don't yes think Yes, I, I am. am. I'm going to I'm going to communicate my thoughts in both directions and and get your your two cents on this. Thank you. Thanks, Scott. You're welcome. I'm just taking a quick note. How do I summarize that best team? I've never oh, oh. Aren't you just, Aragwen, as I do? Thank you, Ellie Spot. That's really kind. Um, I really appreciate that. Uh, on a somewhat more private note, I do feel like that, I, I realize that that moment kind of, <laughs> Crosshair, I'm loving uh, a movement-based deck, Spider-Man 2099. Uh, anyway, that's a whole other thing. Um, yeah, I, 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 know, I know that probably came out of nowhere because it felt a little bit like it came out of nowhere. But, but, uh, yeah, no, I think that's pretty much all I have to say about that. I think it, it felt like it was coming out of nowhere for me in that moment as well. Oh, big hearts, Ellie Spot. I know, I know you all do. I know. I just feel like this was such a, this is, again, it's a great opportunity, or it was a great opportunity for Yang Su to be like, okay, I'm going to just tell this person how I, you know, how I feel. And then... In classic fashion, a couple people were like, oh, that was handled so poorly. And he's like, hey, man, like, I'm just trying to handle things the best I can, you know? Uh, cool. Yeah, Flower, I can talk about that. I can't pre I can press the button. Uh, I have to find it, but just give me two seconds and I will find it for you. I have to find it. Player stats. Uh, show balance. There we go. So, yeah, I the black diamond at the right hand side of care is where I am currently. The dot that's filled in is my center. So I am currently at the end of my track, about to fall off into care, and I should be thinking about what I'm going to do next. Uh, and then that will shift my center. But yes, correct. Hashtag the hammer. Okay, I'm reading this. This is good. You're about to do something important, and you're having snack foods. It's time to get the romantic emotional thing in order so it's not hanging out there in the back of your mind doing the other big thing. Okay. Okay. Right. Right. Eric Wen. Yeah, I like that. Mm. No, no problem at all. Uh, my friend. I hope it'll take us back. Okay, I kind of fucked it up, but I someone will be able to figure that out. I'm hoping. I feel oh God. Oh, I, it's fine. Someone will figure it out. Um, what else do I want to say? Oof. yeah. Well, look, hey, look, we're driving towards, if not the conclusion of the campaign, then certainly a conclusion for this part of the campaign. You all know that we're, you know, driving towards like looking at new systems and looking at new games, but we don't know exactly where we are. No, not at all, Aragorn. Rest, be well. Be well. Yeah, my center is going to shift one, but that's that's totally cool. Um, I have to decide what I'm going to do out there in chat land i know there's some there's some ill folks there's some baby screaming folks uh but there's a lot of folks here Ooh, ellie spot i hello will oh my god can i have that now is it mud or mug i'm gonna i'm just gonna write it down okay mm, it's probably not a mug cake uh yeah you're not wrong crosshair i would agree ah the golden arches uh, I should definitely take 
Mr. Vampy Vamp. Vamp. I'd probably get a little bit of The vegan mud well. cake is only bubbling you a saw little it. this You time. saw that. Oh, I'm supposed to vamp. Okay. Oh, we're good. We're good, Kung Fu Tenders. Don't worry about it. Mr. Vamp. Oh, you think Vamp. you think I meant like Vamp. Vamp. Ooh, just get the hell out of here. Hello. Hello. Welcome back. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. No, of course. I think it's very important that we get to communicate. Uh, I need to look at this again. Really yeah. Hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man. Well, am I good? Yes, I am, Kung Fu Fenris. Um, it's uh, a thing with, like, knowing that this campaign might be coming to a close at some point. Sorry, bud. Soon-ish. You know, we haven't exactly decided things, but, like, wanting to make sure that big decisions that you make don't jeopardize the end of the campaign. So I basically wanted to talk through to John to make sure that we were on the same page. I'm good. Oh, Thank okay, you, folks. Okay. I should start thinking about me because I'm at the edge too, and I'm probably going <laughs> to come into the same situation. Let's just all start losing our shit. Why not? Yeah. You could hold on to it and wait for a vastly more critical moment for you to lose your shit. Punch Bashira in the face. Throw soup on her. Go into the spirit world. <laughs> Encounter Ko. Yeah. Submit to his demands. He wants your face. <laughs> Give me your face. <laughs> yeah. He's a simple little guy. He just wants your face. That's it. Yeah. So Flower of August, the deal with the ads uh, for non-subs is that we specifically trigger an ad break. But if you're a sub, ad breaks don't do anything. Yeah. But specifically for like when people do a raid or if someone would randomly come across our stream, usually Twitch will force you to watch an ad before you can actually see the content, which I know that I do it, and I know a large percentage of users do it, say, ah, uh, forget this, I'm done with Twitch for the moment, I'm gonna go do other things with my life. So if we disable pre-rolls, which is what happens if we play ads, we buy time where they aren't gonna force ads to newcomers. That's why we do it. We don't care about the 12 cents. We do not need the are 12 you, cents. Are you kidding? It's not 12 cents. Like, it's that's 12 like cents, like, a month cents. total. Yeah. Like, it's nothing. We aren't doing it because we want the money. We were doing it because we don't want people to be faced with ads. Uh, very much so, Flower Vargas. They are strategic ever. ad breaks, and yeah. that's exactly what they are. No, face stealing. Do not submit. Weirdness, I gotta say, your choice of emotes, it just... So There's so choice. Every time you you play an emote, I'm like, yeah, that that is exactly what is everything. It's so good. Are we back? It's quarter to four. Whoa! Oh my god. Yeah. Whoa. This would be about the point where we'd be like, I guess we should throw yeah. the recap. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, what are we having for dinner? Yeah, okay, basically, right? Out. Box. Uh, Charming. Are we, are we back at this point? I think so. Yeah. Who gets to volunteer for who I talk to first? I'll do it. Opened it, Flower. You are, if I'll find people who may not have been here right at the beginning. Yeah, I uh, showed balance. I think it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I tried to hide balance, but mm -hmm. is it reset? So, break is over. Good to know. And this is where you're at in terms of balance. You. As I said, you look like you're about to shift over. So I'm going to pull this scene back in, and then you'll be able to make your choices. But I warn you that this is happening. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so you need to make a choice here now whether you're actually going to do what you're supposed to do or whether you're going to once again fail us i was appointed by the spirits themselves how can i be failing them if i stand with them and if you don't understand that then i don't know what i'm doing here i've been protecting you ever since you got here Every little thing that you've decided to do, every little gallivant, I've spoken for you. I've held on to the belief that you were important for this order. As though I'm the only one who wanted a tryst now and then, who wanted to go off and see what life outside these walls could be? 
You understood that because you're just like me. The difference between you and me is that when push comes to shove, I am going to support this order. Now are you. If supporting the order means standing against the spirits, I can't. And I think you know as well as I do that the choices you're making are jeopardizing them. You are putting them in danger. You haven't even consulted them. <sighs> do I have to leave? Am I out? Am I, am I kicked out? No. But I think that there's going to be another seeker joining this expedition instead of you. I'm not surprised. You're confined to quarters. Go. Is Takata my mother? What? No. No as in no or no as in you don't know? No as in no. Go to your quarters. And I'll explain later. Uh, she, she turns and storms out. She does not go to her quarters. <laughs> okay, where, where is she going? <laughs> she doesn't know, but she storms out of the temple. Um, Means that you are taking, this is a destructive action that you're taking. Yeah, yeah, okay. that's, that sounds about right. All right. Uh, that means... <sighs> For anyone wondering, mm, we're good. At this point... Da, 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 da. It's not here, is it? It's it's down here. Uh, you have a button to do it, I feel. It's... I do? Yeah, it's in here. Oh, yeah, I, I, sh I sure do. Oh. Uh. Oh, she's fleeing in a destructive way. Yep. <laughs> ah. oh. Yeah, you're, you're currently... Wow. You know, freedom and we'll, we'll deal with your center shift a little later. It's after had some time to recover and recenter themselves. Okay. As you leave, and it's clear that you're not going to your quarters, there's a few acolytes who look up and they're like, Don, you're back! And, like, I assume... She, she doesn't acknowledge... She's not, like, she's not, like, shoulder-checking people, so but she's just but your, very direct. your speaker outfit that you're wearing? Yeah, she's wearing it. Okay. Right. Can it even... Uh, she does swing by her room and grab the other clothes that she was wearing, the ones that she'd folded and laid on her bed. She grabs them and continues on her way. Young Sue. <sighs> There's like the the quivering finger is still kind of pointed at now Oda. Um but then it but then it drops and like Tears fill his eyes. I can't. I can't stay here. I can't do this. I can't. I'm. I'm too angry. I'm too angry about all the opportunities that I've lost. And I didn't know. I want everyone to have the right opportunities in life. And I want to as well. I want you to, to do what you need to do with Bashira. What are you going to do? Not endanger it. Young Su, you have value. You can be a good pair for someone. If you don't want to be with someone, that's valid. But don't write yourself out just because you don't value yourself. So, Scott, you are being pushed off the edge, which means that you're going to have to take an extreme action in line with your principle and flee, lose control of yourself in a destructive and harmful way, or you're going to have to give in and submit to your opposition, which, I remind you, is at this point Bashira mm -hmm. and not other characters. So, 
It's got to be one of these things. It can't just be a, a gentle, I'm going to walk out of here. Everyone. Of course. It's fine. But you are allowed to delay it until Bashir arrives, if you wish. For drama. For maximum <laughs> drama. Um, what, I, what I want to do is essentially, like, give of myself. I want to, you know what I mean? I want to give up everything that I have to these two in order to, to ensure their success. But I don't have very much materially. Take my blood. Yeah, basically, right? It's something like, something like that. An extreme action in line with care feels like supporting these two. I will offer you. Yeah. By the time to make you know that if you're present, Bashira may not be able to to do that. And submit yourself directly to Takata. To put yourself into the spirit world. Without being like immediately. To, without being able to consult with the rest of your friends. Yuck. <laughs> We're making yucky choices today. <laughs> it's not like it's not like people can't go to the spirit world, right? <laughs> That's a good offer. It's a good offer, and I'm gonna take it. You don't have to tell right them that you're going to Takata. <laughs> um young su like goes over and and uh starts to go for a hug towards bow and then pauses can i hug you yes and then wraps bow in a big hug i have value i know i know i do why does this feel like a goodbye it's a just for now squeezes his arms. Like, I, I feel like there's a bit of a parting going on, so Bao squeezes his arms a bit. I can mean, come chase you. You'll find me. They're well-toned arms. Yeah. Okay. He's fit. Oh, hello. You'll be able to find me, don't worry. Really? And just know that I'm gonna find myself. Okay. And then I go to uh, no Oda as well. And then I ask, can I hug you? You can. I offer and I wrap now Oda in a hug as well. Feels like you're deciding to do something stupid. Very possible. Try to contain it. I have to find myself. Let us know what you discover. We'll all hopefully be able to see the real me. You'll find me. No doubt. Never failed to find someone before. If there's someone that I want tracking me, I'm glad it's you. You leave? I, yeah, I nod and... Get what you need, or kick her ass. And then I leave. What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> That's a fair fucking question. So he made a deal with Jai that he'd tell people about his feelings, and that's how he says his feelings? Why would he, he made make a deal with Jai with about Jai? me? What the fuck happened? <laughs> Wait, he has feelings for me? But also for Kai Ming. Also for Jai? I thought Don had a thing for Jai. Jai doesn't strike me as the talk about his feelings type, but I mean, I haven't spent much time around him since our childhood. Okay. What about you? What about me? I'm not about to scream my feelings at you and storm out. <laughs> Legit. Good. Legit. I love it. You're like, oh, I'm caring so much, but I'm also doing it so forcefully. I'm <laughs> so <good." laughs> like, yeah, I guess you can towards care, but my God, did it feel like force? Oh, what the hell is happening here? <laughs> Door opens up. 
and you can hear. You won't believe the kind of a spread that I've had set up for you. After all, we have to make sure that we keep our pro bending team fit. And Bashir turns, walks in the room, and Varric closes the door behind her. Whether or not you're a part of the team after this is another question entirely. What is this? Are you surprised to see me alive? I thought you were dead. Why? Because that's what's all over the news. I'm so happy that you're alive. Are you? Bashira. We know. Know what? What, what? what could you possibly know? Everyone on that ship survived. That includes Go. That includes myself and my friends. I wasn't too drunk from that drink to get out alive or to help people survive. I have no idea what you're talking about. We have witnesses to your actions, to your escape. But that can stay inside of this room. She's right, you know. Everything can stay inside this room, including your corpse. Oh, whoa, whoa! <laughs> there, <sir. laughs> she tried to sink the thing, too, and she succeeded. Shira is a great firebender. I'm sure she's a great person. She was just misled by the other conspirators. Isn't that right? It feels like you're trying to intimidate. Ooh. I'm going to give you a plus one forward to this because you did clearly prepare. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to ask you to roll with Sion. Yeah. Oh, oh, do I have a thing for intimidate? I feel like we talked about this and said I should. Maybe. I don't remember whether or not I bought it. Like a move? She tried to sink the thing too, and she succeeded. <laughs> the gray, gray oh, line. So it's really good. strong, yeah. <laughs> I want to start busting that out in day to day. Because I only have one in here. So good. Maybe you didn't end up buying it. I've checked off the other thing. Okay. I'm going to leave it. Oh, it's Roguish Charm and Chasing the Dirt. Great. Um, great. Nope, I did not. Fantastic. Thank you. For your patience. Great. So, Passion, but with a plus one. And this technically is a thing for progress, so Kunku Fenris is correct. You can spend one uh, fatigue and then you roll with the fact that you're sitting on a plus three for progress. Sure. But this is with the knowledge that you intend to use this information to betray your family's traditional attempt, or at least the traditional side of your family, mm -hmm. which seems like what you're doing. Mm -hmm. So, if you want to, you can do that. Yeah, I'm at 2 fatigue, I think. Uh, let's have a look. Yeah, let's do it. Alright. I needed that. Whoa, yes! Uh, that brings me to 10 with the plus one forward. Alright, so that means that you can choose one of the following that I can't choose for uh, Bashira. They run to escape or get back up. They back down, but keep watch. They give in with a few stipulations, or they attack you, but off balance, they start with a condition marked. You can't run. Can't run? Can't run to escape or get back up. Mm -hmm. Dang. Next one, the next. <laughs> Takata made me do it. She's been doing that to a lot of people. She's been doing it to a lot of ships. There was at least one other ship that went down a month before. There have been more. Not all of them have had survivors. But every single time, we had to use spirit vine technology in order to make sure that the ship went down to make it look like it were spirits forcing the ships to sink. She said that if we didn't help her, 
it wouldn't matter that we'd die anyway. What do you mean die anyway? Do you have something on you? I needed money. I, I wanted to be a pro bender, but I couldn't afford the training, the equipment, the... She offered to sponsor me, and I took it. And then said that she found a team that I was going to be able to play for. She points to Varric. But that she needed something in order to repay the start that I gave her. And by then... You were already in. I was already in. Thank you. I know. She looks like a huge weight has lifted from her, but it's left a husk. Mm. Well, Eric is understandably upset about the damage to his ship, but I also know that he can cover your costs and repay any outstanding debts. I'm glad slightly towards Varric to see whether or not I can that. Like, I oh, promise he can oh. see away. Um, Turns out Selwan has a lot more money than I thought they did. I don't have debt. We'll I just... Cross that bridge. Everything's been paid for, but... At this point, Takata can have me thrown into jail or worse based on what I did to the ship. We won't let that happen. I won't let that happen. I, I could testify against Takata, but who's going to listen? She's a councilwoman, and she's got so many people willing to stand up for her. The Even president. the other saboteurs, they're not going to all have... They'll just speak against me. You have the word of those who saved everyone aboard that ship. You have the word of Beric, and I think that there is someone who outranks her in the city that Beric may be able to speak to. Now let's be fair. Just because I have a connection to the president doesn't mean that I'm going to be able to use it for this sort of thing. Hot. Look, <laughs> I wasn't on the ship, and as much as I'm grateful for the fact that you managed to save all those people... I think you can talk to her and say that maybe something's going on. She'll at least listen to you. She isn't going to listen to me. Well, of course she'll listen to me. Everybody who's anybody listens to me. I'm Varric! <laughs> and I'm not. <laughs> no, we can't promise that everything is going to disappear easily. But we can promise that we're on your side. So what? We take Bashira to the cops and she... Gives her confession there. I mean, that's. I'm sure Takata has bought the cops too. So, who's she going to present this evidence to? Sorry. I'm, I'm having like 78 thoughts at once here. Mm -hmm. I'm like. I have 78 thoughts all the time. <laughs> that's why I'm here, and there, and everywhere. <laughs> Man, I wish I could turn to Yong Su right now and ask him his thoughts. Yeah, he's gone. Yeah. He whisked out. Hey, where is that kid anyway? Yeah, you have any I thought there were three of you when I left here. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, he's running along the beach. Shards of fire. Shirtless. Shirtless. <laughs> weeping. We're working on gathering more than just one testimony. We know that she has been buying everyone off. She knows that she's been using people to do things like sinking ships. We know that she is organizing an incursion into the spirit world. And your ship sinking has helped that narrative. Again, I understand your reasons. Don't you just hate rich people? What? I'm not rich. I'm smart. There's a difference. <laughs> you, you gain leverage through what you create. He's not even here. I'm just talking to the wall. But every once in a while, you talk to a wall and the wall listens. Yes. I'm going to need to figure this thing out. 
Get in here. Slum guy comes in. Oh, yeah. Oh. Invert me. Oh! Yeah. Uh, and we're back. Nothing's gonna happen to Julie, because otherwise I'm gonna. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. That's why I have to think. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'm just in a bit of a slime point brain wise. So, um, That's okay. I don't know do what to what to do. Why don't we shift over to yeah. the gruesome too, Simi? <laughs> God damn. Mm hmm. You have no idea, everyone. Flip me for real. Cool. So one of you has stormed out of the Order of Passages Temple. Uh -huh. One of you has stormed out of... <coughs> uh, Ferric Global Industries. Ferric Global Industries and is now headed to Takata. Where I'm headed. Which I assume would be her her office. Yeah. yeah. Where are you headed? Heading to the airship. Oh, Jaipu. She's trying to find him. Oh, he would definitely not be at the airship anymore. She's heading to where she thinks he might be. Uh, so as you storm out of the office, there's a car following you. No, for God's sake. Is it the cop? <laughs> Is it the police car? Yes. Okay. She, she is wearing her seeker robes now. Oh. So she turns. Mm-hmm. What, like I'm supposed to be impressed by your clothes? I'm just seeing that this is a pretty good indication that I am who I say I am. So you're a seeker in this order of passage. Yes. Whatever that means. Follow me if you want to follow me. Why don't you follow me to jail? Am I under arrest? Should you be? Are you arresting me? They are asking about that. <laughs> Do you need to be arrested? No, I don't need to be arrested. Are you going to continue following me? <laughs> Is that a problem for you? Oh my god. She turns and keeps and keeps walking on her way. Hey! <laughs> she hey, picks, she get picks off the rose! Beep, beep, beep. And then you hear a <laughs> whip, whip. And then everyone else behind them shuts up. <laughs> <laughs> Just drives really slowly, but yeah. <laughs> so you are now causing a traffic jam. Beep. Beep, 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 beep. I mean, she's not walking on the road. Uh, and uh, she's not getting in the car. So she'll happily take other paths off the road. When you get to the port, <laughs> <laughs> the ship is gone. Uh -huh. But there's one ensign who is cool. stacking a few. Oh, yeah chairs oh hi hello ku hi hi i am looking for general jai general jai went off with councilwoman takata oh i believe that they're probably uh city hall or whatever we call it here i don't remember <laughs> oh, that sounds right though yeah that sounds right okay thanks she heads for city hall Okay. <laughs> God fucking damn it. I mean, police station's pretty close to City Hall. But it's pretty far from here. <laughs> Just gonna keep walking? Yeah. All right, that's it. You're being suspicious. Get in. Why am I being suspicious? I'm running you in. Why am I being suspicious? You have to tell me why I'm under arrest. Why am I under arrest? Slowly gets out of the car. Because you're impersonating a member of the Order of Passage. I am not impersonating a member of the Order of Passage. Really? I am wearing the robes of the Seeker, who are appointed by Fox Spirits, sent by Wan Chi Tong himself. So if I went to the Order of Passage right now, and I asked whether you were a Seeker, and they, you are on official Seeker business, running back and forth to the uh, thing, that would be okay. Believe it or not, I am actually allowed to walk freely in Republic City without always being on official seeker business. Well, then you should mind my asking. I don't mind at all. Go ahead. 
All right, get in the car. No, I am not getting you in the are car. You under arrest until I sort this out. You cannot say I am under arrest. I have done nothing wrong. That's it. And he pulls out cuff. Oh, sh- oh uh, can I um, can I earthbend myself into a kind of catapult to get out of his reach? To flee? Yeah. Oh yeah. Great. One hundred percent. She's so done with him. <laughs> she is so done with him. Now you're evading arrest. <laughs> you hear. Wee, 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 was the she will. Uh, oh, we've left, but we'll be back shortly. I imagine. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we're fixing the cable. Give us two seconds. This is what the cop sees. Nothing. Nothing. No, <laughs> uh, she's gone. Yeah. Um, what she is aiming to do is stick to the rooftops. Um. She wants to uh, just stay where cars it's can't reach her. It's just like being on her. podcast. It's an audio drama. It's an audio Good. drama. Good. Hooray! Yeah, we're replacing that cable. Anyway. <laughs> um, so she wants to stick to the rooftops. Okay, so the theme from Assassin's Creed 2 starts to play. Nice. Yes, great, great, great. Um, I want to target Machiavelli first. <laughs> So as you're chasing down, and then you're uh, you're still headed towards City Hall. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, you've definitely taken a destructive action. Then that's what happened. Mm-hmm. Uh, you let's just you're going to rely on your skills and training to get out of this. So why don't you just roll that? This is your you know using earth bending to parkour yourself along. Uh, that is fourteen. Yep, no problem. Oh, good. <laughs> you lose him, but you manage to get to City Hall just in time. <laughs> just in time to see uh, just outside City Hall Takata Opening her arms and greeting Young Sue. You're far away from this at this point. You can see it, but you are not close enough to do something about it yet. Come inside. Young Sue bows deeply just so that so that far off Don can see this like genuflection happening. We're so glad that you're ready. The speech is prepared for you if you wish to read it over for tomorrow. I should. Come in. And then Young Su is guided into the building with Takata's arm wrapped around his shoulders. What is going on? <laughs> That's what they're asking in the chat. It's a good fucking question. Is there any sign of Jai? It's not outside. At least there's no sign of that cop either. Oh, good. It's true, because she didn't tell him where she was going. Nope. Um, uh, uh, she's gonna... Can she hop to the roof of City Hall from where she is? Yeah, it's pretty tall. You'd have to climb to get to the top, but you could use earthbending to do so. She will attempt to do that. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna make you roll for that. You can make it to the top. She's peering into windows as she passes, trying to find somebody she knows. Oh. Somebody she knows. Someone she knows. Um, preferably Jai, uh, Young Su, or who else would be in there that she knows who isn't trying to kill us? No, that's uh, it. That really that's narrows it. the list, actually, Liz. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, the president, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she'll settle for the president as well. <laughs> Can you just roll me a dive luck, please? Sure. Three. Uh, no, you don't see anybody on the way up to the roof. Yeah. Mm. Uh, okay, then she uh, will look for uh, an, an unlocked or open window that she can That's slip in through. Okay. You can get it. She's going to do that. You are currently in uh, a records office. <laughs> to settle for the president. A records office, eh? Yeah. Um, okay. There's no one here because it's late in the day. All right, she's going to... Um, look for something maybe like a book or something Inside, right? mm-hmm. 
I think so, yeah. Honking. It's not like our computer being like, we're going to die. Track. Uh, she looks for something that she can wedge under the door. Okay. And Salvica called it. She's looking for um, records of, of, like, birth announcements. Okay. It seems like you're trying to assess your situation here. Yeah. Hold that. Remind me, is that with creativity? That is with creativity, I mean. Jesus Christ. Um, that's uh, 12. Uh, so therefore you get to ask two questions. Okay. Assessing. Uh, while that's happening. The speech is right here. Here you are. Passes. The speech is actually pretty innocuous. It speaks about how you have... Uh, you... You had to pay a price for progress. And while you're sad that your village is gone, although the city... Uh, it, instead, it is just written uh, city name instead of right. Andong. Yikes. Uh, while it's gone, you now have the opportunity to be a pioneer, an explorer, and that you look forward to living in harmony and peace alongside your spiritual brethren. And then there's a little thing underneath that says uh, insert uh Insert voice of spirit on shoulder. Uh, and I, I kind of glance up at the council. Well, where's your spirit friend? He'll be there. Oh, good. Good answer. Why do you, um, why do you need to involve him in this? Well, I thought it would be natural. Clearly, you have such an affinity with this spirit. It will go over well to show that you've already made friends. Indeed. <laughs> I'm so glad you're on board. And to show. She reaches into her desk and she pulls out a report. Of the damage that was done to her office. And then she, with one finger, places it against the paper, and it molders, and then burns away. I can be a great friend, Young Su. It's very, um... Thank you for keeping your word. I'll be honest, I didn't expect you to. I always keep my word. Otherwise, it's worth nothing. It's true, isn't it? Of course it is. I'm nothing if not teller of truth. There's an entire world out there willing to move forward. You get to take one of the first steps. You know that's good. See if you can work that into the speech. Councilwoman. Yes. You told me that you didn't see yourself in the spirit world, that you would never see yourself living there. That's not what you wanted. No. What do you think I might find there? Illumination. That's what I'm looking for. I'm so pleased. How, um... How did you survive? You've lost people, and he, he looks down, he doesn't, he doesn't want to, like, he doesn't want to name, he doesn't want to name things right now, but he's going to suggest it. It'll be specific if he asks you. I know that you must have lost people. People close to you, people who mattered a lot. How did you survive? Always keep moving forward. Even when that forward puts you into conflict. Especially when it puts you into conflict. Sometimes best ways to know who should be walking alongside you are the ones who aren't standing in front of you. I 
can't believe I'm saying this, but that makes a lot of sense. I know. Why me? Because you live in a cupboard under the stairs. You're a chosen one <laughs> archetype. <laughs> You're on the hero's journey, just like the rest of us. Oh, oh the fourth wall is breaking again. Okay, okay, sorry. Why you? Because I believe in second chances. Now, I'll be back soon. She gets up and walks out of the office. Bow. I'm taking steps. We are taking steps to expose Takata. Whether that's in a court of law or in the public eye, she has been using people like yourself. She has bought off my family. And I will be fixing that as well. Without the Sawans, she does not have an army to populate the spirit world. Without individuals like yourself, she doesn't have soldiers to take down her enemies or spread her word. Whoever you need me to tell my story to, I'll tell it. But you have to promise me that I'm not going to go to jail or my family. I will do everything within my power to prevent that. Of course you're not going to jail. I'm not going to press charges. Listen, there were like how many saboteurs? Half the crew? That's a lot of people. There'll be more than enough people that'll be able to fill and rot inside those jail cells. <laughs> you don't have to be alongside them. You can be on the side of right. Side of good. Side of Varric Global Industries. <laughs> <laughs> I know that at least a water vendor. Um, Tandon. Tandon. At least Tandon was involved as well. Was the whole team involved? No. Just me and Tandon. Do you think he'd speak up too? might I can go and get him the more the more people we have the easier this will be I'll be back she gets up she back glances the down I'll go with you is that necessary? Yes. Very much so. If she plants bombs on ships filled with innocent people, you don't trust her to try to hurt someone who she worries may have turned. So for you as much as it is for us. Don't worry, I'm going to do what you ask. And now leaves with Bashira. Well, I mean, you should eat something. I should. Thank you. Um, Beto will grab whatever food is closest and jam it into their face for a second. You really do care about your family, don't you? my whole life being told to. If there is a way for me to save my family from its own foolishness, then I would like to. But they're in debt, and Takata has promised them money. You managed to convince them to turn over their tech 
to me. Null invest as a partner, not as an owner. You have to convince Kaisuke. She is an excellent creator. She isn't going to. She isn't blindly faithful to the fa to the family, but no, you can't oust her. I'm not going to convince anyone of anything. You are. Then her conditions are going to involve a certain amount of autonomy, which I hope you can respect as a creator yourself. I'm not going to stand over anybody's shoulder. I've got my own things to worry about. The thing three. <laughs> Listen. If you really care, your family's already been bought. And I'm not going to lie to you, what I'm doing is essentially buying them out. Again. But I'm not trying to take over the spirit world, so there's at least an advantage there. But if there's something that you can do for your family, stand up. Take charge. And when I'm going to tell you how to do this, I'm going to teach you how to do the thing. Thank you, sir. So, this is a special technique. Uh, you are going to do a training move. So, first I'm going to ask, uh, are you in balance with your center? No. Are you free of conditions? Yes. Take plus one. Ooh. Do you and your teacher share at least one background? Uh, privileged or urban? They do. Take another one. Does your teacher agree with your reasons for training and learning? Yes. So you won't take minus one. Okay. <laughs> and is the technique easy to grasp based on your current training experience and skills? He's offering to teach you do the thing. Yeah. So that's your choice. That that sounds like it's yeah. in my training and skills. Okay. So mm. uh, roll with plus two. Hmm. What am I rolling? Just a roll. Mm -hmm. oh. That's a six. Okay. You're going to need another lesson before you can grasp its full use. So, Eric is going to give you a task that you have to undertake. Once you've done it, you'll be able to use the technique. You're going to have to learn not just how to amass authority, but to stand up to authority. I think you're going to be able to get it once somebody tells you what to do and you make it clear in no uncertain terms that nobody tells you to do the thing. You tell others to do the thing. <laughs> Do you have something specific in mind? No, this is a, this isn't a, I'm not t teaching you the rest in, until you do this. This is a, I am telling you the thing, the the last step before you're. Okay, so you. sorry. It sounded like I was going to be sent on a specific No, class. no, no. Okay. He's telling you that this, this is, is what how you, it will click in my brain. Yeah, this is how it will click in yeah. your brain. Incredible. After some time discussing this, along along probably some of the other tech stuff that he's yeah. taking around in the office, um, it feels like he's taking a real shine to you. Yeah. You know, like, you remind me of me, except not as Water Kingdom or Water <laughs> Tribe. <laughs> I'm not a kingdom. Fuck. Not yet. King Varric. God, no. Oh, <laughs> that's absolutely not what I want. Very true. Too much rules. Yeah. <laughs> but now returns with both people. All right, I'm um, I'm ready to uh, I'm ready to talk. I'm ready to listen. So is Eric. He crosses his arms, pops a <clears throat> way too big piece of fruit in his mouth, and starts to oh. chew it enthusiastically. 
now pulls out a piece of paper and starts to write. Birth records? Yeah, so the two questions I would like to ask. What here can I use to find proof for Jai? Okay. And what should I be on the lookout for? You can't find anything here as proof to Jai. Okay. Not in the record center. Okay. Um, but I'm not going to ignore the question entirely. Okay. Uh, I, you'll be able to find circumstantial evidence, but you're not going to find proof. Okay. Uh, and then what should you be on the lookout for? Yeah. Uh, you should be on the lookout for Takata. Any, ref any record referencing Takata herself. Um, but specifically, you should be looking at a adoption records right around when the order of passage got a hold of you that's what she does mm. you learn the following how old is don uh uh late early teens 20s. early 20s yeah early 20s. so about 20 years ago uh you were brought here not by Takata, but at the behest of somebody working for her. And by here, do you mean Republic, Republic City. City? Okay, cool. In it, the records indicate that your father, who was engaged to be married to Takata, died during a journey to the spirit world. Takata was not interested in taking care of you and thought that the best thing to do would be to pass you along to somebody who knew about your uh, heritage as a sandbender. The only place in Republic City where sandbenders are known to keep any amount of presence is... The order of passage this doesn't mean that your father was a member of the order of passage but he was a sandbender he was a sandbender does it say you say takata wasn't interested in in raising don does it say that takata was her birth mother or Takata was not her birth mother okay specifically her fiance already had a an infant child mm. Your birth mother is unknown, but clearly it is not Takata. Because Takata didn't have to give you up for adoption. Remember, she was engaged to be married, which mm -hmm. meant that she hadn't formally adopted you. And she also didn't have any claim on you anyway. Uh, so when Don reads this, she slumps to the ground. Um, is there a way to make a copy of this with the tech? No, they don't have like photocopiers if that's what you're asking. All right, so she'll just take it. Now, it should be imparted to you in this report that uh, there was a small sum of money left behind in order to uh, pay for your initial care. Okay. And by a small sum of money, it was probably actually a pretty decent sum of money, but not like $10,000. Oh! Right. Well, actually, ten thousand. Oh, it's going, not. That's not a whole lot of money, right? Me. But like, it, it clearly there was. It wasn't like you've been left a whole fortune. Yeah. Uh, but they, you were essentially delivered to the order of passage, and there was a sum that was delivered alongside to ensure that at least you could be raised to the point where, at the very least, you could leave if you wanted to. Cat. So there was enough left behind for your care. But strict instructions were given 
that it was not it, not meant to be held in trust to give to you. It was not meant to be a donation to the Order of Passage. It was specifically a, this is to take care of her until she reaches the age of like 16, at which point... <laughs> ah. Wow, e Maui. The report makes no uh, mention of anything in terms of like a spirit coming to you or selecting you or anything like that because Republic City doesn't give a shit about that and the Order of Passage wouldn't have volunteered that information to them. But it does mention your name. Ooh. Don is indeed your name. Oh. makes her tear up a little bit but you are officially named don daughter of tabor t-e-b-o-r T -E -B -O -R. Before you ask, there are no records of Tabor beyond this note. Um, she does take the record and, and tucks it into her pocket. I see seeker robes have pockets. They clearly they do. They, they think ahead. They do. That's oh, where yeah. we keep all our pocket sand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ah! Uh, it takes her some time to like peel herself off the floor. Um, but she... <laughs> there's like a dun shaped. Sound. Yeah, just like with little puddles of tears. And then you hear a. That's funny. Door stuck. That's okay. Just kick it. Kick. Does she recognize the voices? No. God no. Uh, she, well, heads you're for, a she heads for the window. Two and three. <laughs> <laughs> Heading to the window is easy. Eventually, when you when they get it open, oh, what, what fell in front of? Oh, God, oh, oh, no, oh, oh. There's files everywhere. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> you left the window open. Bob, did you left the window? No, Bob. It wasn't me. Damn it, no, Bob. Friend, it wasn't me. I, yeah, brother, like right. Yeah. <laughs> you're now outside City Hall. Ugh. She's gonna look for Jai for a little bit longer, but she's not gonna put herself in unnecessary risk to do so. Um, if she comes across Young Shu, uh, she's gonna try to eavesdrop on what's going on, but she won't make herself known. She definitely avoids Takata. Um, if she doesn't find any of these people, she's gonna try to find Bao and Nao. So probably head to the tea shop because that's the only place you can imagine they'd be. Oh. Uh, roll me and assess the situation, but I'm going to give you a minus two. Okie dokie. Mm. Eight. Okay. You can ask a question. Uh, Cabbage Corp is not involved with City Hall. They have their own mega building. Flower Hell walls. yeah. What here can I use to find my friends? You can ask somebody where, oh. where they are. That's probably you're going to be your best bet. You're going to have to directly ask. So she's not going to do that because <laughs> she's, too, she's too freaked out by the cop and the order and all that stuff. So she's she is going <laughs> to... She's gonna. She's gonna head back to the the tea shop. Then, she tucks the clothes under her arm, um, pats the pocket with the birth record, the adoption record, and uh, heads for the tea shop. Okay. Young Sue. Yeah, I was left alone in Takata's office. Yes, you were. I I I would like to see uh i would like to see if she has any um private notes relating to this incursion into the spirit world so you're going through her desk i would like to snoop yeah okay 
Um, why don't you assess your situation then? Uh, no. I will not. Uh, I will, uh, I got a five. Um, uh, cool, then I'm making a move. That's totally cool, yeah. So as you are rifling through her desk, her new desk, seeing as how the old one busted to shit, that's right, yeah. As you are rifling through her desk, door opens up. I don't, I don't meet her eyes. What are you doing? I now meet her eyes. Coming still in Kiyoshi Warrior get up. Why are you here? I'm here to move on. The next phase of the plan. I'm here to go into the By going through her desk? just wanted to see if there's anything I could use. You just don't know when to take the win. If you get caught, she's not going to believe you anymore. You get buried in a ditch somewhere outside Republic City. I don't get it. I don't get I don't get why she why she trusts me at all. She seems to be sincere. Because Everybody who she comes across gets into debt with her, and they all do as they ask. She has you. At least she thinks she does. Just like she has my sister. But it's as if she actually cares. Like she wants me to be able to move on, to do something different, to, to find people to walk beside in this new world. I don't know why she's doing this. But I know what my sister's been doing. What? He comes around to the, you know, in front of the desk. It's my parents. They fell in with Takata, and my sister has been paying their debt for them. I mean, I'm so sorry. More and more. The things that she asks... There's more and more promises of good fortune, of wealth even, and yet it ties you further and further in with her. The point where you can't get out, where... The, you can ask someone to do the most terrible thing and they'll do it because otherwise everything else was for nothing. Can you imagine committing so many crimes and that you have to keep committing them otherwise all the other ones were for nothing? Yeah, I can't imagine. No one should have to be in that position. No one should have to be indebted and, and forced to do things against their will like this. She's been going to the fire sages. She's been... And then she just collapses onto the ground. Uh, I'd like to go to, like, hold her, you know. Can't cry. The makeup runs if you cry. Mm -hmm. Breathe with me. That's my sister and my parents. I don't know how much they know, but... I've been holding to my honor for this long, and none of them have any left. That's not a reflection on them or on you. You've all made choices. That's okay. There's footsteps coming from outside. I let Kaiming go. Well, sorry, I, I try to haul Kaiming to her feet. See you tomorrow. 
And she dives out the window. Oh, sh- What? Uh, Takata comes in. I'm, I'm kind of moving towards the window, like, uh, just as if I were observing the world. I've arranged quarters for you for the evening. Thank you. Is there anything else that I can do for you before tomorrow? I'll need briefly to leave this place in order to recover my friend. Ha, ah, the spirit. For the speech tomorrow. Of course. Just to make sure that he's there. You may go. I know you'll be back. The quarters are here. Yes. I appreciate what you've done for me. I made mistakes. I made a lot of mistakes. And I'm glad that we can put them behind us. Feels like you're trying to trick an NPC. Yeah, I think so, so I'd like you to roll with creativity. Uh, okay. Eight. Okay. You can pick either that they're going to stumble, so you get to take plus one forward to acting against them. You can have them act foolishly so that I will give you an additional opportunity or they can overcommit and they'll be deceived for some time. Plus one forward would kind of operate for some time, but not forever, right? Like it would be sort of within this scene or, or, or so. No, it think, would or just it. it more yeah, it wouldn't be for forever, but it wouldn't necessarily have to be this scene. Yeah, I'm going to take plus one forward. Okay. Within the next day. Got it. Bow. Takes hours. But the two pro benders both have stories of how Takata found them in positions where they needed assistance. At first, it was just money and then a small thing to repay some of that debt. Then it started getting worse and worse. Very easy ways for Takata to threaten, but not overly so. Just a reminder that if things didn't go the way that she wanted, that she had all the evidence that she needed to take them down and anyone they cared about. In fact, they both independently speak that they were worried that she would enact revenge on the entire team as opposed to just themselves, and so they felt more and more obligated. The more you did for her, the more dirt she had on you. They were told that all they had to do was to make sure that the ship was ready to be sunk, not... So they weren't involved in the destruction of lifeboats. They weren't involved in the sabotage of the radio. They just knew that the ship was going down and they were told that this was because Varric had crossed Takata and that it was a message being sent directly to him. That everyone was going to be fine, that they were in a part of the ocean where everyone was going to be able to make it to shore easily. They seemed to be genuine. Mm -hmm. There's no indication that they believe anything different, even though you clearly weren't in an area of the ocean where it was easy to be <laughs> found yeah. and yeah. Uh, all of that. Yeah. But both of them seem to have just a weight again lifted, but that a husk remains. They've been living this life for so long. Now that they've finally told somebody, it feels good, but there's nothing left. Who knows how many other people are feeling like this? Your family? Them? Anyone who has... Who isn't so over their heads that can't come up for air. I think there are some people that are so deep that to admit that this is the wrong course would be to admit their own failures in ways that they might not be ready to. 
as complex as her involvement with both of you has been, I think she's gone much deeper with others. Thank you. We're going to write this. I'm going to make sure that you have a place to stay here tonight. After all, at this point, your informants. We have to treat you as such. You'll be protected. You're just training for the upcoming pro bending circuit. Yeah. Yeah, why don't you head to my gym? I never use it because I'm not a bender. Do you mind escorting them up there uh, now? Yes, all right. You make sure that you take care of yourself, too. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Then she heads out with the two probenders in tow. Thank you. Your er, you've made a world of difference already. I'm not going to pretend like it isn't going to benefit me, too, kid, but... At the same time, I'm not upset if everybody manages to make themselves a little bit happier at the end of all this. Thank you. I think you're going to be very welcome. It's going to make their exit. Head back to the tea shop. There's no one there. Except. Huh? Hey, little guy. Ow. Have you seen oh. anyone in the last little bit? So the spirit just is sitting on um, the bar where the stools are still overturned. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it looks like it's been kept up remarkably well. Uh, the the tea shop is not in any way uh, messed with, but uh, the six little stumps are waving and sort of thing. Bow. Yeah. Have you seen Young Sue or Dun? Ah. Uh. Hungry? Let's go get some dumplings. Uh, it goes to the closest dumpling shop and gets way too much for just the two of them, hoping that her friends are going to return. Oh, looks like you're returning. Yeah, I get Ha. And where were you going to look for Ha? Uh, this would be the place. And you? Uh, Don stops at a, a market stall on her way to the tea shop to get different clothes oh what kind of clothes uh just some like like a lycra cat suit <laughs> yeah exactly just some really unremarkable generic republic city clothes so nothing that Regular that claims everything. allegiance to any of the any of, any the, of the, four, nations. Any of the nations yeah definitely nothing seeker-esque um okay she changes into that as soon as possible. Takes her hair fully down. Nice um, purple outfit. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, hell like yeah. Going through the colors, I was like purple. And uh, so she changes as quickly as possible. Her hair is now down, and she continues on her way to the tea shop. Okay. So you all converge. Dumplings, and hot. Miss Shears spoke. Miss Shears talked. So did. Found on. Good. That's great. Barrick is amazing. Dylan, Barrick is amazing. Oh, you meant Barrick. Yeah. Yeah, I, th I thought that was him. Are you okay? I, no. No, I'm not. Push the dumplings closer to Don. Um, I stormed out of my order. And I think... Takata's ex fiance is my dad. Oh. But she's not your mom? She's the one who arranged for the order to take care of me. 
Don just holds out the paper. Processes. Isn't that kind of nice? It's something. It's something. It's something. That means that she isn't your biological mother, so that changes the complexity. Doesn't mean it removes it. I saw you there. At City Hall. Shit. Sky by Sky <laughs> What were you doing there? I was getting ready for tomorrow. Gotta be nice and shiny to go into the spirit world. Are you okay? Yeah, we're gonna be okay. Are you okay now? I didn't ask if you're gonna be okay. Uh, after a few more of these... just believe her lies? They did what they thought they had to do to preserve the Order of Passage. Apparently, they've, they're have they being financed by the Sawan now. So it's not believing lies, it's just believing money. They have that enough money sense. to subsist for another five years. Why could her not? You need money to survive. If it's the Sawans, then I can... I will take on this debt. But it's not, right? Like, the Sawan had this huge gold theft, and now Takata's using that as a way of manipulating them. How could they afford to support an entire order? Are they just... She's funneling funnel money through. Yeah. Yeah. Where does she get all of her money? I'm going to the spirit world tomorrow. Oh my. Not as the Seeker. What? I'm going. Not as the Seeker? No. No, we, um... We couldn't come to an agreement. So Kyung's gonna be there, and... People can't stop me from going. I'm going. And I'm gonna see if I can find Ko. I'm looking forward to being a Seeker. <laughs> Well, that, um, because maybe Ko will tell me what's going on. Maybe. If he stole my father's face. You deserve answers. John. You do. We all do. Taps. Their oh. robes. Mm -hmm. You mean like with the dull thud of a mirror scale? Yes. Other answers you seek tonight. I'll think on it and let you know. Wow, oh, I think one of us should take the scale into the spirit world. I I know it's probably not safer there, but it might be useful. Are you coming with us to the spirit world, Val? Mm -hmm. Actually, yeah, that's a good question. <laughs> think on it. Yeah. And if you're not, maybe I could hold on to the mirror scale. I'm going to be significantly less important there tomorrow than you. Yeah, I'll see. Not to assume the worst, but... Ko can only steal faces. He can't, like, mind control you, right? He can't. He wants to talk to me. I want to hear what he has to say. I want to know if he and Takata have an agreement, or if she's trying to get revenge on him through all the spirits. I want to know if he's the reason why she has so much money and means to manipulate people. I want to know what she promised him. We need to eat up drink for tomorrow. There's a a man approaching the tea shop who is wearing Fire Nation uh, army mm. clothing. Mm. Sawan Bao? Speaking. Sawan Bao, it's your mother. She's asking for you. Then I shall... There's one thing. She's asking you to come alone. 
extracts hot off. That's the follow for Tiangsu. Immediately, like, kind of clump, clump, clump. Um, do I have a moment to get changed? I was traveling in this, and I don't want to be stinky. I will wait for you. Uh, I was gonna head into the back room, give an intent glance at Don. Don follows! Oh. Help me out of the zipper. Of course! Uh, have all their clothes. Oh, uh, dear. Uh, oh, you do, though. Uh, uh, Don offers to you assist. Have shy's old clothes. Or shy's old clothes. <laughs> None of these are good. None of these are good. I love it. Um, uh, purple of Republic City. The black and red of Jai's clothes. Yeah, because the secret robes are like a sage green. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, yeah, Don's wearing the purple, and yeah. then Jai's robes are, yeah, like red and black. I guess I'm going to go with it. <laughs> yeah, it feels weird to wear yeah, secret robes. Weird. Like, I think that's yeah. pretty cool. So sorry. And you're passing the mirror scale over? Yeah. You are now in possession of the mirror scale. <laughs> you are now in possession of your cousin's clothes. <laughs> <laughs> they still take a moment to like do whatever they can to like turn the cuffs and the collars and stuff to try to make it look like an intentional choice mm. uh, to be very Fire Nation. Because uh, I think they've been wearing something not so overtly. I don't remember. That sounds right. Uh, but they keep their other clothes. You look yeah. great. Yeah. Don't see you again tonight, Dubuck. Can I? No, oh, hugs. Clunk. <laughs> and uh Be well, Bow. Young Sue also. Bow takes an extra moment trying to see how Young Sue's doing. Oh uh, waves. He seems, uh, that's a good question. Yeah, he seems uh, serene in this moment. We'll see you soon. Yeah. Oh, heads off with the soldier. As Bao leaves to head towards who knows where, as Ha clings to young Su, and every once in a while steals another dumpling. And as the weight of the mirror scale, promising everything, weighs in your chest, I think we'll end the session there. Woof. Woof. Woof, woof. Eight. Yeah. What did you learn? Uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Um, learned that. Sorry, there's like twelve ideas. Uh, um, hundred percent. That Varric uh, knew about the ship sinking, uh, and was already, you know, involved in all of that. Mm -hmm. Varric's directly involved rather than just remotely. Elizabeth. Uh, Don learned who her dad is. It's true. Yeah, Scott. It's true. Uh, I learned, although Young Su, oh, Young Su did as well, that uh, Takata is specifically weaving people into a web of, of blackmail. You know, uh, Ashira, Kandan, and Sela through Sela's parents. Uh, did you stop a dangerous threat or solve a community problem? <laughs> no, no. no. Uh, did you guide a companion so towards much. balance or end the session at your center? Guess what? Two of you did. Yes. Oh, we're yeah. Up, we're, we we're back up now. Yeah. Technically going to reset the center. Yeah. Uh, so, this one. Yeah. So you, you will advance. <sighs> uh, and then finally, hey, did you learn anything about your family? Not really. Not today. Uh, Elizabeth, did you accomplish a deed worthy of your role? Nope. Did you? Nope. Scott, <laughs> you progress towards overcoming your adversary. I mean, kind of the opposite, right? 
So I think we're going to leave your growth there, but you yep. will advance. Yay! So over here on Fancy Corner, we also do like to talk about ourselves. So, oh. Kate, do you want to call someone's play out? Yeah, I'm going to call out Liz. You were faced with a really difficult situation. Mm -hmm. It's a struggle that we've all been dealing with, balance, that where we're like, oh no, but I'm being so this, but you're also being so that. And the potential costs mechanically of doing something, even though it feels right story-wise. Like, it's a tricky thing, and so, like, I know that, you know, we moved away, we came back, we moved away, but, like, you still navigated it really well. So, like, mm -hmm. thank you for the way you tackled it, and also, like, being relatively open about the struggle, because that's a struggle we've all felt. Thank you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Scott. All right, yeah. Um, I thought that Yang Su's frustration at um, not being able to, like, trying to be honest with people and then getting shut down for it or sassed for it or mocked for it or whatever, uh, just it just felt like a really touching moment um, because that frustration then pushed him to be even more honest but somehow even more articulate as a result. But then it also made him follow a destructive path. Sure. So like it, it just felt very young Sue and it and it felt like I'm angry at myself. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I, I I loved it. It's very very that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah 100%. Maybe a little, a little more swearing than that would wow. possibly. <laughs> I'm angry at my yeah. fucking self. <laughs> <laughs> they got they get one and that's where they use it for sure. Uh and I uh wanna compliment uh you, Kate, on Bow today. I felt like the way Bao was sort of like taking command of the situation with Bashira and Kandan and kind of navigating this very powerful barrack was really cool. But I'm specifically going to call out, um, actually, in that same scene, mm -hmm. being able to like jumping to Naoda's defense and clapping back at a friend is, it felt almost, almost out of character for Bao to be so direct about something, to be like, how dare you? But in that moment, it felt to me like, two things became very clear, right? Like, care, not care for now, but like, you know, defending now, and also trying to sort of support Yong Su on his journey. Mm -hmm. It's good, it's good, like guide him, you know? I mean, there's also that soup song of, I turned down now, and now you're also like walking in just like, hey, just now. Just like that, yeah. You know, feelings? I don't have the feeling, like, have right? And I was like, oh, I just did this to now, like, no. Yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> no, of course, of course. Like, there's definitely some self-serving in it. A hundred percent. But that's, that's yeah. that whole balance of it was like, you know. So we can see you almost were saying, hey, now, you're an all-star. Hey, mom, go play. <laughs> Look, I've had those lyrics memorized since 1997 or whatever year the fucking CD came out. So y'all are poets. Yeah, don't even try. Don't, don't even. You <laughs> can't comfort Kate. What is this? Oh my god. Varric! Yeah. Yeah. An excellent representation yeah. of yeah. a key player yeah. from the Legend of Korra. Yeah. We I love remember, like, Varric. Yeah. At the beginning of the campaign, I was like, I wonder if Varric's going to make an appearance, but then I forgot. And so when he did show up, it was such a surprise all the same. Mm -hmm. um, oh my god. It was so good. It was so That's great. a really good representation. Because I remember you saying ages ago, you were like, this is one of my favorite characters from Korra. He is my favorite character. Well, then there you go. Okay, yeah. great. Cool. He's amazing. Yeah. So, yeah. well honored. It's it's so risky to be like, oh, I'll play a well-established character of that course. already... But... No, it, it felt true to him. But yeah, very right. very yeah. much. Yeah. Uh, the Crosshair asks, uh, Young Su said, I'll be okay, but do you think that the group will be okay? A vibe check? The group? Yeah. 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 The world? I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know. Maybe Probably. People accidentally collapsed the spirit portal behind us, and all of the spirit portals will be trapped in the spirit world forever. Yay! It's true. But we'll be okay because we have the seeker with us. Hooray! And then Cora will be like, oh, okay. Have to wait another 10,000 years for harmonic convergence until they're <laughs> That's going to be rough. Well, today. The biggest, I think, thing that we're going to have to deal with is that, you know, Whoa. normally we're like ready for dinner and yeah, we're you know, getting, getting pretty hungry, yeah, but yeah. like it's also not later in the evening. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be a bit of a, a reconfiguration of my own time sense. Mm -hmm. 
It's still light outside. Yeah. yeah. But uh, we do still have some stuff happening in the week. Always and forever. Uh, I will be streaming on Tuesday evening on twitch.tv slash Biff the Boss. I thank you, Scrub. Um, I've, I've taken to sort of deciding a little more last minute what the Tuesdays are going to look like, but there's a strong possibility we're going to be jumping into the new vampire game. I hear there's three protagonists, and I have at least three characters on my channel. So. Swan Song, you mean? Yeah, is it called Swan Song? Yeah, the new the, the newest one that came out okay. quite recently. Uh, it wasn't I that recent. Either. It's been a year or so. Uh, already? Yeah, Damn, man. Anyway, yeah, but like, I've, I've had- Not to say don't do it. No, 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 I- like, Bloodlines 2 is it out, Scott. Oh, no, it, yeah. it may never. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, uh, I'm really jazzed about that. But we'll have to see if I want to also like take a little break doing something short too. That's me, Tuesday at six o'clock, Eastern. Uh, yeah, Wednesday, Thursday, John, do you generally, do you have problems? Uh, so last Wednesday, I underwent a scrub check. I oh. just barely <laughs> Woo! didn't scrub out. I managed to eke my way one up the leaderboard on, I have to submit that speedrun. I haven't submitted it yet, but uh I'm gonna see my way one up the speedrun board on Super Mario Brothers 3. Yes. So I'm gonna see if I can find another challenge like that. Throw that in there. Um, clinic hours may or may not happen. I'm hoping that it will. If it does, that's going to be on Thursday on this channel. Uh, there are some new features that Twitch has announced. Things like Twitch stories and uh, Twitch uh, kind of clip discovery which makes me think that we're, there may be some things that we'll have to look at, but uh, we'll see. Those are only coming in the fall, and they may also only be available to partners to start. We'll see. Friday? Friday, we are punching yes. around. <laughs> Got a punch. Punch around. Um, and then Saturday, we are uh, continuing Drew Crew, mm -hmm. and then Scott is this room. That's right, at 1700, my new, uh, my new obsession, my new fun game is uh, The King's Dilemma Chronicles. You've seen it on this channel. Now watch it again on my channel. It's a different experience for sure. The Emperor Scotimius is making different decisions. Scotimius gets to dress in far more uh, comfortable clothing. Yes. <laughs> considering oh. the climate right now. Oh yeah. Which we love. Um, that's gonna be Saturday at five o'clock Eastern. Sunday? Sunday there oh. is Punchy Book Club. Um, I'm gonna figure out what form that takes. So stay tuned. I'll update on Discord once I've spoken to Kathy. But we're most likely going to be seeing some folk. Oh yeah, uh, we've we've got a uh, we got a few more sessions to to punch at this puppy. Dig That's not really a closet. Oh my god! Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we, yeah. But I'm looking forward to that. Uh, at the same time, I'm also I just got to say it's so nice to see a, a nice big active chat. It's super helpful. Uh, but I, we would love to know what you think. So just head on over to that Discord and uh, go check it out and let us know. Because honestly, it's your feedback that we want and crave and it's all we care about. It's the currency that we exist on in this world. <laughs> uh, actually, the currency that I exist on this world is, is moving. It's, it's going that way. I'll see you next time. See you later. Bye. 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 Mwah. Bye. Mwah.